and fabric tear. It was close, that one. Welcome. Are, it's are we rolling hard. on all the cameras? It's going to be hard through this material here to get the right sound. Yeah. Welcome to episode number 16, everybody. The Marty Michael Fully Actual Podcast. We're fucking here with Jimbo, Jono, James, and yes. fucking us three. And we got a jam-packed episode for you. Let me tell you what now. We have we, a guest coming on. we got a guest. We've also got... Um, Double guest. Matt Brown's diary entry has made a return. I had some time to write one. We got Tinder Adventures. Matt's going to get a brand new chair at the end of this one. It's all gone crazy, bro. <laughs> Look at my arms. <laughs> wow, what the hell? <laughs> raise the roof up. Raise, raise it raise up. The roof up okay? Raise the roof up. Raise it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you, you are still quite got that one-handed. fucking Star Wars sticker, quite- I see. <laughs> I'm talking to James. Yeah. Um, um, you are quite one-handed when you have this. Yeah, you are a bit. Yeah, well, I'll sort that out on Monday. Yeah, thank you. I'm married now. Yeah, holy back, Lily. I He's got married. I got married on Saturday. And it's fuck. a nice ring. It, I saw it today, and it was, it's very nice. Yeah. Yeah, it's just like a black steel ring. It's, it's opal. thick. I found it. It's opal. Is it like? It feels like it's going to come off. <laughs> no, it's not. Look at that. You pull. You're yanking on it. Yeah, that's true. But like when I'm at, when I've been in the bathtub, though. is it annoying yet? Like, does it like feel thick and on your hand, or can you? No, not it's okay. It? I don't mind it. Is it heavy? Yeah. Fuck! It was a fun night. Tell yeah. us about the wedding. Oh man, the wedding day was so fucking fun. It's just fucking. Oh, it's a it little was bit so fun. A little bit like we just got here at like nine thirty, and then just fucking. I can't even really remember the day, eh? It was perfect. <laughs> yeah, we it was all, so all just fun. hung out together. We had really nice wine. Yeah. And then Jashan came over and the videographer. We got some f- footage and some photos here at the Brownery. And then we had started having some fucking shots and some really nice wine. Oh, world-class oh, tequila yeah. too. Lukey busted out his really expensive tequila, yeah. which is good shit. Yeah, and then we fucking went to the wedding and there was a little bit sort of um like nerve-wracking during like r- just waiting for the bridal party to arrive but totally fine and then the fucking speeches were amazing everything and the fun night was just heaps of fun it just went so quick james like, lee boom, Nate, and michael had a beautiful speech nailed him yeah we complimented each other really well i reckon michael yours was more like the comedy sort of comedy lead in and then a really nice ending and i kept the niceness going yeah sorry greg so easy to speak about mart though he's we love him so much it was easy to write wrote itself (laughs) yeah well there you go boys fucking such a good night and then i have one complaint yeah. Walking out like that was so <laughs> fucked, man. Oh, the dancing. You know that thing where, yeah, oh. that, you know that thing. I don't know if other people have had to do this at weddings, but where it's like, oh, the groom's party and the bridal group is really important. So we're going to walk out like celebrities. <laughs> you did a Johnny. You came out dancing oh, a Johnny. I hated that too. Yeah, it's. I guess I was okay for me because I had Esther. Yeah, so she's she like a little small. Girl. I can just be like normal. See, I had a good time too. I had Amber who was just full of energy and just motivated me down. Did you get to twirl? I twirled her and then oh, I was like, yeah. everyone. Yeah, so see, Amber's, I reckon Amber again is a good one to do it with. I, I yeah. Shout out to fucking Luke though, because I thought Luke, like, I don't know if the, if the fans know Luke that well, but he's like fucking reserved. The guy who throws shit really he's hard. The yeah. So we thought he would like hate that. And he just went full Ricky Martin. <laughs> I guess you probably <laughs> it'll be on the website eventually. So well, the website yeah. people well, get if to see people, it. If people want to see it, like I feel like because people are paying for that content, so uh, let us know in the comments if you'd like to see for a website video the wedding footage. Because if you guys just want to see our regular shit, totally understand, and we'll just keep pumping those out. But like, if you guys want to see, because we there was a videographer there who's going to make like a fucking sixty minute fucking video out of it, so we could just like kind of cut out the crap and just mm. show you the best thirty minutes if you want. Let us know in the comments. But yeah, fucking great night. So much. Fun. Jackson was MC. He yeah. did very well. And um, <laughs> yeah. oh man, it was just so good. And then we just. Mon and I just went home at like 12 and just hung out and everyone else just went to the fucking some <laughs> nightclub oh, yeah. that Julian organised a booth at. There was oh. like just some fucking full of 18 year olds. You couldn't hear, oh, hear yourself man. talk it apparently. Rough. It was I was, not a I good was leaning, party. leaning over the booth because they're all kids. <laughs> all kids. Yeah, I was leaning yeah. over the booth going, you got beautiful hair, man. Oh. And just complimenting oh. all the fucking all the dudes. Chicks. <laughs> Yeah, chicks and dudes. Yeah. 
<laughs> Michael got a bit silly on the dance floor at one point. He started climbing up all, all of the really expensive tables and stomping on them and screaming at everyone. Did you I, see that? I, I did oh, see you at the very end. end. Yeah. Yeah. Right, yeah. All the girls were like, get down. Get Ma- Michael, get down. I don't remember that at all. That Matt- part. No, yeah. <laughs> oh. Connor, if what? you put that in there, I guarantee, I swear on my mother, I'll bash you. Oh. <laughs> oh. Leave that in though. Yeah, yeah, Please leave, leave, leave that leave part in. in. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Cut the actual thing, yeah, but no leave talking. that in. Yeah, I didn't know. I didn't know. I'm sorry. Yeah, you fucking knew. <laughs> I don't you want to talk about that. <laughs> no. Dude, do you reckon Connor's going to take like issue oh. with you saying you'll bash him and oh, leave yeah. it in as revenge? He should be feared. <laughs> oh man. He should be feared. What would your first? Strike B. No, nah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't bash him. I'd just be. I'd. I'd probably be very, very Cross. upset. I'd probably not be friends with him again. <laughs> okay, all right. We won't talk about that. But oh man, so you guys, I could pun. forgive. Just, I'd be fucking upset for many months. Really? Oh yeah, I don't want it in there. Okay. Okay. Please, respectfully. Yeah, yeah. No, so, no, it's cut. It's done. We don't need to keep talking about the fact that you. <laughs> <laughs> and then fucking yeah. What else? Yeah. There. So and night ended there. And then, man, it got so sloshed. And then me and Mon just fucking partied on for the next two nights. I thought I was gonna have like wake up with heart shit and stuff. But I just woke up and I did a little bit. But then just started drinking again. And then another wild night. And then woke up the next day and just started drinking again around the pool and, okay. and getting food. Yeah. So far Dude, so that good. Pool. It looks like the best. Mm. Yeah. We just literally you just scan the little phone. You're ordering cocktails and just oh. food just all day sitting around the pool oh that does sound yeah, nice that does so sound nice good. should do yeah. that as a website vlog tomorrow all day yeah. oh <laughs> and now like i'm just so like because yeah i was meant to start work again yesterday it's wednesday now so we want a little mini moon we'll do a proper honeymoon like when we have some money again because fuck me that wedding's expensive but holy shit just feel like absolute shit now just so <laughs> tired i could just fall asleep which is so rare Dopamine's gone. Yeah. Everything's just been sucked out of my head, but worth it. I'm a fucking married man now, can't. Mate, are you gonna tell are you gonna tell everyone what you did? <laughs> Go on. You owe it to Luke. To Luke. Oh yeah. yeah. I owe it to Luke? Yeah. Wait, can you remember? I'll give you a hint. Matt started a fight. Matt, oh, Matt, tried oh, to get into my, Matt, Matt did tried something to get else, but no. we can't talk about that. But Matt started a fight. All right. Yep. <laughs> I did not start a fight. I want to know what else he did. But anyway, we'll get back to that. Because then I want to say, you did something. You looked at me like I knew no, something. No, no, I, I got confused at what you were okay. talking about. I thought you wanted to know about my weekend. Oh, oh fucking yes. here we fucking but go. Later. Okay. Here we fucking go. <laughs> Matt's fucking weekend. So I just, you just threw me off. I got confused. Oh, yeah. So, um, yeah, me and Lukey left that nightclub and everyone was gone. And we, me and Luke were hammered as fuck. And there was a dude, we were waiting for a taxi and we we're like, let's continue this and go to the casino like we just would not stop and um <laughs> and this dude was standing there and he had his like arms crossing his stand up he had like he had like sunglasses that i thought i'd seen in the pile of our sunglasses and i was like and i pointed at him and i was like oh dude those are cool sunglasses and as i pointed out i think he thought i was gonna grab them and he sort of flinched back and was all like upset about it and i was like oh like relax dude i'm not gonna steal them and then he and then for some reason luke like just knew that the guy was antagonized <laughs> as fuck. And Luke just sort of stared at him. And instead of being upset with me, the guy looks at Luke, the trained fighter out of the two of us, <laughs> and goes, you want to start something? <laughs> <laughs> Which is like calling someone a bitch in jail. Like, yeah, and you like, don't normally get away with that. <laughs> and I was so shocked. And then like, by the time I looked at the dude and see, so he had like five mates with him and they were like looking at him going, dude, what are you fucking doing? And me and Luke look like we're bikies, bald headed, you know, dudes. And, and by the time I look back to Luke to have a laugh about it, his jacket was on. <laughs> no. <laughs> and he was ready to go. And then like the dude looked at me, uh, one of the little guys walked up me and said, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. And like, didn't want a bar of it. So I knew everything was fine. And I just sort of grabbed Luke. You should have fired up at him. Yeah, yeah you should have kissed that guy. See, I, I, I pictured what was gonna happen. And I said, I said, in most scenarios, we would have just let that go, but it was right in the middle of like Brunswick, like on the corner there. I was just like, this will just get arrested. <laughs> so um, so I so I took me all my muscles to hold back Luke because he's a strong boy. And I said to him, he wouldn't go. So I said to him, I said, Luke, I promise if they follow us around the corner to the other taxi rank, you have my permission to punch <laughs> on. And he went, all right. 
<laughs> and of course, to get him away, he antagonized the fuck out of him, hoping they'd follow. Luke. And um, yeah, I was, <laughs> and I couldn't help but laugh. It was hilariously funny to watch. It's so funny that Matt and Luke went out together. Oh, no, isn't that cute? <laughs> and they live here. We together. had a great, yeah. we had a fucking great time together. I, I really enjoyed Luke at the wedding. It was so much fun. <laughs> And um and yeah, we got to the tax rant. We stood there, and Luke made me wait like at least five minutes <laughs> to oh. check. And when you got back here, he passionately yeah, he goes <laughs> fuck. Missionary <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so, style. Yeah, so but yeah, we nearly got into a fight. But the 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 it was better to walk away from that because I really do think Luke would have leveled that guy pretty oh, bad. Always, and it ruins the night. It just would have been such a bad ending to a, such a good night. So. Yeah, so fucking married now, eh? It's uh, and that was the weekend, and now it's just we're gonna try and recover, and here we Start fucking again. are. Hmm. Now Michael's next. Yeah, five months. Yeah, I think. Shit, next week. So we man. do it all over again. Bucks. Can't wait. Yeah, to oh, yeah. Bucks are so fun. So man. good. They're my eh? favorite things. To <laughs> That's happen the now. best part of the yeah. wedding. Is the bucks? <laughs> no, the wedding was very, very good. But bucks is just so fun now. Oh yeah. yeah. We were Holy talking shit. about what we were gonna do for. Bucks. It's just like a boys yeah, trip already. on steroids. Yeah, yep. Yeah, it really is. It's a good time. Yeah. Because you got that, there's like that necessity that you have to come so no one can bail. You yeah. have to go to a bus. Yeah. And it, you ha- you're like, you, it has to be really fun. There's no relaxing. Yeah, no. It's just, it has to be really intense fun. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's the best. Low pressure. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I knew Michael was hammered at the wedding. Oh, yeah. During the speeches, you just hear this every now and then. You hear this, oh yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh okay. He's every yeah, he's channeling that it. old dude from Big Daddy. And Jackson kept pretending to have an anxiety attack while he was emceeing. <laughs> oh yeah, that was so kept saying good. it. I have a lot of insecurities, <laughs> <laughs> and then walk away from <laughs> people who are a bit confused the first yeah. few times. Yeah. Yeah, they fucking were, bro. <laughs> 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 and that's our fucking weekend, man. We're going to golf. I've, the boys got me a new golf set for um for my birthday. It's oh, an yeah. expensive month for you cunts. Yeah, oh, you've been a very expensive. Cool. It was Even like the friend. wedding, we had a wishing well. That's a bit more fucking cash. Man, you guys really had to bloody. Yeah. But when you come across a bargain, you have to get it. Oh yeah. yeah, so I've now got the best golf clubs out of the in the group, and yeah, I'm fucking. So now I have to go get lessons and shit. Coming. I'm running out. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> played with James on Sunday. Like it wasn't even a bad shot. Like <laughs> it wasn't good. Have, yeah, but like it was. It wasn't an important match. It was just like a, a quick hole before the sun came down. Yeah, and he just threw his wood or his hybrid straight into a pole. <laughs> Snapped it instantly. That's but like a two hundred and fifty dollar club. They're fucking fragile, aren't they? Those I was clubs? battling with that all day though. Like it was, I was, I was so close to throwing my clubs <laughs> so many times. I was like, no, come on, it's just golf. You should be having fun. You're with your mates. It's a good time. But then like this flash of white happens, and I cannot control. Oh man, <laughs> I, I, you really do just see red. Yeah, yeah. I feel yeah. I was responsible. No, <laughs> I did a couple of good shots. And you were having a horrid day. Oh, dude, you must say. That would be embarrassing. I like it. I'll, no, no, I like it when any of my mates play well, but okay, I good. know I'm, when, I'm, when I'm playing that badly and I know I can play better than that. And I was a bit tired too from the wedding. And it I was so rough with it. Anger well when, I'm, when I'm tired. <laughs> yeah, I agree. It was it was <sighs> the hard hardest match that day just because it was so fucked from yeah, the night before. Yeah, I can't believe it. Brown still on a pitching part got four pars no. out of 18. That is, that course though, that is, that's is got yeah. Brown all over yeah. it. He I, loves the short game. Deal. Short game is not bad. Mm. Oh, so, anyway, so can we hear about his weekend. Yeah, oh yeah, okay. oh fucking hell, here we go. It's going to be another three-hour episode now. No, no, I just had a, but you know, besides the wedding, I had a really good time oh. on Friday. Luke came back, and when Luke comes back from his his mine, he he just you have this over. You, I'm sure you feel this. You're not lonely anymore. Yeah, I'm, I have this overwhelming sense of safety. Yeah. Yeah, you it's know? the best when he comes and back. And then, you know, I said, you know, he went to bed and I just sat there on my own. I got a little chocolate. Giggling and you didn't have to check all the yeah, doors. Yeah, didn't have to check all the doors. You know that Luke will protect you. Exactly. I sat there, had a little chockey bar and I watched a movie on I my own. I reckon if rapists movie? came in though, Luke could let him fuck you first before he bashed him. <laughs> <laughs> rapists? <laughs> yeah. If no. rapists came in. But what's the movie that you watched, sorry? Midsummer. Dude, great Whoa! I really? Can, yeah, that is quality film. It was uh, Sweden, Sweden. What the fuck, Sweden? 
Oh, the no, the, the cold horror. thing. Yeah, cold movie. Horror. Yeah. Great horror film. Oh, so you watch it on Netflix. Yeah. What do you think? Let's talk movies. Oh, here we fucking uh, go. Really? Should I, we go, Mark? I, I, should we save this no. for the review at the end? You can review your fucking midsummer nah, shit. I'll, I'll get it done in really quickly. And I'm Two s- sentences, go. I'm so happy you asked. That really puts a fire in Oh, me. I shouldn't have done this. What have you what done? What have you done? I forgot you're a loser. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> um... Yeah, there, there hasn't been a, a, a cult horror classic like that in quite some time. Some weird, weird shit mm. going down. And um, yeah, it was very beautiful. And you got to see penis. It's very Not very normal in films. You would have loved all the sex scenes. Yeah, I got it. Oh, yeah, that. that's, that's right. Why. I, I think that's the goal for the future is to have sex on the ground while like 15 women are in a circle chanting. I yeah, mean, yeah, yeah you would love that. That's a tough goal. <laughs> yeah, it is. Well, Fuck. Well, follow your dreams. <laughs> I would love to see you do that one day. I would, yeah, I would love to see you do that. Can I be one of the pe- naked people yeah, of chanting? Course, <laughs> of course, yeah, you guys have got to be there. Yes. They will push They push him into her so he can't, like, not come in her. So then yeah, he has it to, is intense. It's really it's strange. It's, have you never seen it? We I James? haven't. No. Oh, it's dude, very good. Watch it with... Um, I'll, oh, I'll back him that. on the movie Sweet. shit weird yeah. stuff right now. Yeah, like watch it with Kaka. be very yeah. good. Um, fucking, um, what was I going to say? Sorry. I also took Bosley for a walk. Anyway, all right. Oh, so that's the weekend. Um, the new website. Um, remember, if you're a member of the original website, you can contact our support and get a link to the new website with a new password. We still haven't publicly announced it because we're waiting to transfer everyone over and just ironing out some of the bugs there, all right? So if you see any issues with it, let us know as well, all right? Because we don't know. We fucking watch the new ones that come up, but we don't go through all the old backlogs. So if you see some weird shit going on, let me, Michael, or James know. Don't say anything to Matt, though. Go to manscaped.com slash fullyactual20 to get 20% off. No, it's manscaped.com and our discount code is fullyactual20 for 20% off. Where's the shaver? Where's the shaver? Is it in the bathroom? It's in my bathroom. Would you wait? You wait till you see this machine that Manscaped has. I swear I saw one. Everyone, you wait till you see this machine. This machine will give you a shave like you've never had before, man. So manscaped.com, fully actual 20 for our discount code. Take it away, Michael. If you want to get girls 24 hours a day. 24. Girl one, girl two, girl three, girl four. four. Heaps of girls. You get this product. Here it is. (gasps) Bang, girls. They just show up. They'll show up soon. And this, you can use this to get the no hair out of your ears, and your nose. Oh, it feels a bit weird. I love it. You probably so nice. get, you probably get high after me using that. Huh. Look at listen. You can listen to it. You can hear it working. Wow, it's wonderful. So if you want to get fucked by birds, left, right, and center. Go to manscaped.com and buy their shit, man. Sorry, I'm so low energy today. I'm no, it's be- good. I reckon. Remember. Girls, this product gets you girls. And girls, it's also for you. Ooh. Once you get, once you suck the hairless man off, the girls tend to go to Manscaped as well. Hey, you yep. think, you're thinking of eating that, aren't you? I can see it in your eyes. You need to talk into the say, microphone, man. Too much going on. I know, I know the brown, and I know it was, it was in his head minutes ago. He's going to eat that. You'll Ma- see. All right, Matt's, gone, Matt's just, just shaved some of Michael's leg hair off. When was the last time you washed your leg? And part of four, our, four hours ago, probably. And part of our just that leg. Four part hours of ago. our brand deal. Matt is now going to eat his leg hair. Go brown. Inhale it. <gasps> wow, it's the second time you've done that now. Yeah, oh, so it's weird that you like to do that. You you eat. Weird. You do it without being so prompted. Put it in your nose and make oh, it there, fuck, man. <laughs> anyway, continue. It's weird that he does <laughs> that make unprompted. It here. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, that happens, man. Anyway, that's Manscaped for you. Girls. And, of course, Athletic Greens. If you, It's got 75 vital nutrients and minerals that you need because you, it's hard to get that shit in a diet. You need to eat so much shit to get that shit in. And this is guaranteed once a day. You put the powder in a glass of water, you scull it. It gives you immediate energy. That is 100% confirmed. We can all confirm that. Everyone here and the people who get it. 
They say the same thing. It mm. tastes pretty good and it just makes you live longer. There's this vitamin D dropper you can get as well. My vitamin D levels are through the roof and that's insanely healthy. All thanks to Manscaped. You can have, use it. <laughs> go to athletic, athletic Greens. <laughs> <laughs> athletic Greens slash fully actual. And you get a free travel pack and it's just nuts, man. It's a subs- monthly subscription. They drop it off at your door and you outsource your health, man. And you can live a bit longer and the tumors might shrink. Probably not. Yeah, they do. They yeah. do. And you know what else happens when you take athletic greens, Matt? You get a green Break teeth. your back. Girls. Yeah. Girls everywhere. Yep. I just realized that. What? Mike's not coming. <laughs> I, just realized it. I just it just literally just hit six thirty. I was like, I was like, oh fuck. And we're all so relaxed. No, yeah. I am Mike Goldman tonight. <laughs> oh, we lied to Matt at the beginning, guys. We said we have a guest called Mike Goldman. We got him today. We pranked. Said, and he believed it up until now. You've been pranked. He got lied to. Yeah. Kind of kick. Fuck! I only just realized it. Was yeah. Scene. I was like, oh, he's not coming. So should we Fuck. put you gotta Matt be on in it. his new chair? You got to be on it, don't you? You you really got to be on it. Fucking Dude. hanging out with you guys. I, I'd say everything I say now is <laughs> a lie. It will, it will be the truth on a lie, and then back. I will yeah. never ever. If talk you sense don't to you. start the day with you guys, yeah. If you come in late, the day is gonna be a fuck day for you. Man, it's like oh. we haven't had a normal conversation in what I reckon six months. You guys don't even know time. each other anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are both changed so much and it's been so long since you've had a proper conversation yeah the trust has been well worn away yeah. there's zero now <laughs> oh. you can say anything to him and he's like is that a lie yeah, yeah, running yeah, yeah that's all you yeah. say to me is that a lie <laughs> running around making sure I move the fucking boomstick over so he could have a boomstick oh it is nice though I've got so much freedom <laughs> yeah, I'm happy you're here now because it's uh, yeah. not wasted that's lovely it's very Look, nice to say sorry I reckon we do Matt Brown's chair of it yeah all right. There's but no chair. Where are we going to put it though? There's no chair. That's a lie too. Yeah, I guess. Well, we have to move everything around. Maybe we do it at the end. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Maybe at the end. And then you can sort of, um, and then people can, you know, have something um, to look forward to. Yeah, we'll show you a new chair, which you'll have next week at the end of this episode. <laughs> do you think um, he cancelled because he wanted to see what Bianca went through first? And then he's like, yeah, it's not for me. No, he's, he said he's really sick. <laughs> All right, look, so I'm going gonna, gonna to get this over with with the little energy I have left. So right now I managed to find... A really old Matt Brown diary oh, entry. Yes. <laughs> you wouldn't believe it. You a diary entry. So yeah. not a have story. You wouldn't believe it. Well, whatever, whatever it is, whatever people know it as. That's what I found. One of those. I've got hair in my teeth. <clears throat> so hopefully I've got the energy to do, to give this what it deserves. That's good, Brown. Mm. All right. Do we don't have a uh, a jingle for the diary? No, no we just don't. do the play the horoscopes one because it kind of Hor- is. Horoscopes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so um, this is where just an old story. I find these stories of Matt Brown and his sexual conquests back when he was a younger man. And he had a lot of fucking issues. Like, he's a fucking disgusting, fucking predatory, fucking psycho cunt. And I don't say that lightly. (laughs) People at work are like, oh, because I've taken the day off now to help do the podcast. And they're seriously like, oh, where do I find it? I'd love to watch that. I'd love to see what you do. And I'm like, yeah, it's not really for you. And, you know, these are like (laughs) proper proper professionals. And they're going to walk into a podcast one day and be like, oh, yeah, I got rescued out of the ocean, out of a whale, cut open, and then 50 sailors fucked me. It's just not on. Has that happened? No, that must be a story story. that we haven't heard yet, but maybe next week. It's a story. 50 sailors ran out. In the, when I was in the whale. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember you being in a whale. With Pinocchio. You've been in a whale. It's yeah. very good. And G- Geppetto was in there with you. Yeah, sorry, Geppetto oh, was yeah. there. All right, here we go. Ah! It was my first day working as a lifeguard in Surface Paradise Beach, and I was applying a thick layer of paint to my skin to protect me from the sun. <laughs> Then I sat back in my high chair, put on my sunglasses, and started intensely staring at the half-naked bodies around me. 
Mm, some breast here and ass there. This is exactly why I volunteered to do this job. My perving session is interrupted by some commotion off in the distance. I see a flailing arm and hear a voice. Help! Help me! Without hesitation, I leap into action. I jump off my high chair and get on all fours. I run like a goanna and sprint for the water with my flotation device around my neck. I smash through a kid's sandcastle and my body slams into a little girl and she hurtles through the air. Get out of my fucking way! I scream back at the group of children. I meet the water and dive under. I let my body go limp so that I glide through the water like a massive eel. I reach the drowning lady and realize that we're both caught in a rip. Please help me! I'm getting tired! A wave crashes over us and we get sucked further out to sea. I offer her the flotation device and try and swim sideways out of the rip. I too quickly become tired and start to doubt whether I can actually do this. I only wanted to stare at people. I never actually considered I might have to save someone. I stopped swimming and try and catch my breath. What are you doing? Get us out of here! I need a break. My arms are dead. <laughs> I join the girl and rest on the flotation device as we continue to get sucked out to sea. Do something! <laughs> I shut up and let me think. I'm not as fit as I once was. I could barely see the shoreline and things were getting desperate. I needed some form of propulsion that didn't require me swimming. Then it hit me. I have an idea. I fumble undo my pants. I flip out my thick, veiny little brown and it floats to the surface of the water. Quick! Toss my cock! What? How is that going to help us, you freak? No way! Listen, lady, I'm a volunteer lifesaver, and this is my first ever rescue. I burnt all my energy getting to you, and now you need to just shut up and trust me. <laughs> now toss my cock if you want to live. The lady looks confused and scared. She hesitates, but then starts milking my floppy flesh. I immediately stiffen and wrap my arms around the flotation device. Yes, keep going. We'll be safe soon soon. The lady turned her head away from me and went for gold. I cleared my mind and started to enjoy my job again. Being, the life, being a lifesaver definitely had its perks. I started getting close. Hang on to me and don't let go. She wrapped her other arm around my neck and kept tugging with the other. I felt my balls start to vibrate and it was time. Here we go! A surge of mints exploded from my little brown. The force of my ejaculation propelled us through the water at great speeds. Don't stop tossing! If I Stop mincing! We're going to drown out here! The lady nodded and kept furiously milking me. We spread through the water against the rip as my stream of ejaculate powered us along. We went over the waves until we reached the shallow water. I continued to spit mints as we flew past all the other people in the water and skidded to a stop on the sand just as I finished. Oh, well done, darling. We're safe now. The girl pushed herself off of me and ran away crying. A thank you would have been nice, you rude bitch. <laughs> I, I quickly put Put my mince covered cock back in my pants as I realize everyone on the beach is staring at me. I shrug as I walk back to my high chair. I shrug. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. You're a jet ski. Holy yeah. shit. Wow. I'm a torpedo. Oh, that's beautiful, that's, uh, dude. That's genius, man. <laughs> you <Shrug. laughs> Whatever, man. Hey. After you abuse her in front of everyone. <laughs> when, you have a, oh. when you're desperate in a moment of life and death. No, you nearly made Mono oh. do that, remember? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Holy shit, yeah, we nearly died. Yeah, yeah you guys nearly drowned in like 13 <laughs> seconds. Yeah, have I told that story before? I think you have. Sorry. Oh. I don't know. <clears throat> anyway. Next Holy time. shit, that was a lovely time. Oh, this is perfect. Um, people were asking about our trip in uh, our story in the um, in the mountains. Oh yeah, go this on. This is probably a perfect oh, moment because I was thinking, oh shit, I, I want to tell it, but I can't. I don't want to tell it without James here, and I was just Sorry. thinking maybe you should tell <clears> it because the time James and Matt had to stay out in the wilderness because yeah, they we, got lost on a hike. Yeah. Dark day. We got spooned. So basically, we went to go hike up a mountain, which is a one that the boys walk a lot. So James- it's Very knew, intense. Yeah. <laughs> James knew it very well. It's where you climb down about four little waterfalls. Um, oh, more. Maybe more. Yeah. yeah, so many. And not so fucking little, cunt. <laughs> Man, that, going back there on the box, it was like, whoa, this is hard. I can't believe we used to do this hungover as fuck. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is the same walk that was walked on in the box. Yeah. And- um. And, and it was in like my peak time of watching Man vs. Wild. Yeah, yeah. So it's like had that all that shit in my head. 
<laughs> so, lucky because it's stopped. No, it, but it's also what got us lost. So, um, oh, true. so yeah. I wanted to make a fire. James was could. full bear grills, but the, the <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's why we were there for so long. What happened was we we went out and got Indian. Oh yeah, before we went, so we had a feast. And then we did the walk and then we halfway through, you get to this ledge and it's like a beautiful lookout at the bottom Devil's there. Devil's Falls. Devil's Falls. Yeah. And do. James goes, we should start a fire. Yeah, I can do this. I've seen Bear Grylls. And we, we, how long did we spend? We're like so rubbing- Stupid long. Rubbing sticks together for a long time. Oh, wow. Did you get any smoke? Yeah, we got smoke. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's, that's when cool. you need a lighter. But yeah, it got to the point where we sort of looked around and we were like, actually, this light's going down yeah, pretty like quick. Yeah, the sun's going down quick. It's a long walk back. We didn't realize that the sun was still out for most people, but once you walk back into the jungle, Dude. it goes dark real quick. <laughs> I've never again seen darkness like that. Like like half an hour in back to the walk. Oh, we were we were, we were put holding like this. Like this. Wonder like, why it's so dark. Your eyes don't adjust not, at all. There didn't was it just nothing. pitch black? I was holding James' wow. shoulder and we were slowly walking, and we were like crossing waterfalls and crossing rivers. Dude, I climbed. We've just paused and not moved immediately. Well, that's what we did in the end, but psychopaths that we were James was he just motivated me and and we we climbed these waterfalls and James knew it in his brain yeah, how I, to I do it I can that's map crazy out the that's no. what you would think that's what you would think but like and and like we were sort of we we turned right we started you know going up the the uphill at the end and we we're like mm. surely this is the way we to miss the car. Every, yeah we kept saying it this is it this yeah. is it and i just kept going and in my brain i was like okay well we're at the we're in the rainforesty bit that's literally the flat area just before we get back to the car so i was like we can't find the car and it's stupid to walk around here. So we just like sort of started staying still and yelling, like t combining together going one, two, three and screaming. Like, James, wow. James like, would walk around. around. <laughs> James would walk around going, Bear Grylls always says, if you walk in pitch black dark, you'll walk off a cliff. And I was like, yeah. fuck's sake. And that could I was have totally all of his tricks. I was like drinking water out of my socks. I was <laughs> stuffing leaves down my shirt. <laughs> really? and warm. I was doing Dude, all the Bear We have to tricks. do a video. Fucking surviving in the bush the longest. And it was sort yeah. of- Without winter. any help. Yeah. yeah. No yep. shelter. It was nothing. sort of winter. Teams, oh, so man. if you either get Brown or James as your oh, team member. Oh, fucking love it. Yeah, that's a- Oh, I should know. Me and Brown I'm, together. I'll I'm all right. all right. You'd be all right. I'm all right. Like, I have to admit, I, I was pretty, Um, I felt pretty calm in the whole situation. Yeah. Oh, whoever gets Luke would probably win. Yeah, Luke would probably win. But um, but yeah, we, and then we sat down. James said, we should probably just sit down. We sat down. And, um, and this was in the middle of fucking winter, by the way. Yeah. And so we, it oh. was freezing cold. Oh, there. really? Uh, for everyone, we oh, didn't take man, our phones. We didn't oh. take our phones because- Idiots. In our brains- Because idiots. In our brains, we thought- um, we It's were nice climb, not having- Yeah, we we're going to climb waterfalls. We're going to get ruined. And this is like, yeah. I don't even know if they had iPhones yet. No, yeah, we had an iPhone. Yeah, so it might've been early iPhone days. I remember thinking, fuck, if I have my iPhone, I'll have a torch. Yeah, Problem yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Oh. And anyway, so we laid down. It was fucking cold. And so we're, and we're like, fuck, it's freezing. And we we're like, should we go back to back? <laughs> oh, yeah. It got romantic. <laughs> oh, so we're going back to yeah. back. And I've just, I've just turned over and said- I'd spoon. I'd yeah, yeah. So we got there. <laughs> so so I went, I went, James- I was a big spoon. I was a big spoon. So I just yeah. went, fuck it, James. That's I am so, so cold. Yeah. And I rolled over and I spooned James Lee, which was- Quite nice. I was wiggling my butt back in. He's, oh, 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 he even he even smelled good even after we're a long just lying walk. on the floor. <laughs> yeah, we're lying on the on the, yeah. on the yeah. We just we just we found it. a nice little flat area, did so you, that part wasn't that bad. Did you get any creepy crawlies crawling? Well, I th you thought, but we no, heard we some shit. We I heard hearing shit. things moving, yeah. but there's nothing like in Australia. It's like what a snake. It's the worst case. Well, it was winter. Imagine luckily. if we're in fucking Canada or something. Yeah, or yeah. like Vietnam. Oh no. So yeah, so we spooned and it was quite nice. And just just when we we're getting real romantic, I hear this like, bloop, bloop, like just in the yeah. distance. And I was like, dude, that was a fucking siren. And we like <laughs> stood up and we yelled out and then they went tur, 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 and yeah. So we yelled out a few times and then we waited a bit longer. And then these two mountain men from the police rescue yeah, just the appeared cool. out of nowhere. And they were like, we were just like, oh, we are so sorry. We didn't want to be those people. We are so sorry. He's like, ah, oh, no, it's all fine. Yeah, we're, they were cool. They yeah, were legends. Like, we're like, how did you find us? He's like, oh, I've been walking bushes for all my life. And <laughs> yeah, we're in the army. And I was like, oh, thank you so much. And yeah, they got us out. Did they we give you water? Five. They, they didn't, but they gave yeah. us, they thought we were injured. That was the first thing they said. He goes, is there any injuries? Are you okay to walk? And we're like, we're fine. We you should have lost. pretended but all your legs were broken so they had to carry you out and then you get out. <laughs> 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 Just go get down. Oh, good. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> 
No, it we was were ter- five <laughs> kilometers from where we needed to be. Oh wow, well, so it was a bit of a yeah. walk. Fuck yeah, we were far. Fucking ridiculous. We missed it. Wow. It was fun though. The walk at night with torches, yeah, and glorious. The walk was at so night, fun. Oh, the walk yeah. at night with those guys, it was so fun. And once again, that feeling of safety with those. Oh, boys. I've just remembered the worst <laughs> part. Just, yeah, yeah, about, yeah, I was just getting to it. Fuck John, do you want to? Oh, did you pay a weird cringe compliment? There's two more bad parts of this story. Oh, we yes. get out. This is the first part. We get out and there's two police cars and an ambulance. And we're like, oh, oh my God, we just wasted people's time. And they did not look happy. And they were not impressed. So we, that was yeah. a really bad feeling, um, wasting ambulance. Because ambulances get wasted all the time. I hate that. Also, though, <laughs> getting also, paid to stand around. So yeah. don't be too upset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Also, James, what was the other factor to this oh. whole story that made it so much worse? Yeah, it was my mum's 50th birthday. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh. And I was supposed to be at dinner, and, and if it wasn't for her, we'd we was we'd still yeah. be in the bush. We'd look like Tom Hanks from Castaway. Oh, You'd man. be there right that now, would, yep. still, hundred yeah. percent. We'd yeah, still be there. It is an island. Yeah, I yeah. think. <laughs> oh, poor mum. Yeah. But she was all right. as 50, soon as she knew we were okay. One. Your mum did. My mum no didn't idea. have a fucking clue. Ju- she was Julie just like, was sweet. Oh, he's fine. Yeah. yeah, I told her when I got home. Oh, anyway, man. sorry about that. Someone asked that question last week, though. Um. So there you go, guys. Also, uh, just going through some of the comments last week, I saw some people saying they miss the um, older formats and some some stuff like that, and some of them would get a few likes. If you could just be a little bit more specific with, with what you would like to see in these podcasts, because... Yeah, because otherwise we'll do what we want. Yeah, and and here we are doing fucking two-hour fucking fuckings, cunt. But we're going to try and keep it like an hour and a half, tops-ish. So, but we'll see how we go. All right, let's move on. I love the longer ones when I've been watching. The yeah, podcasts. I get nothing but positive from. I love ones. them. It's just it's anyway, doing them hard. Do if it. you hate the long ones, say in the comments yeah. too, because it's good to know. Uh, yeah, but I think for newer newer fans, you're more likely to listen to something you have never heard of, you've never listened to, if mm. it's like not two hours as well. We should, I don't know. We'll let's see. do three thousand hour All long right. podcasts. Oh my, Michael, that's a great idea. Michael's already high as fuck. <laughs> yeah, you can see his eyes slowly get more yeah. slit like. <laughs> slowly just goes into the couch. Sinks into his, his chair. chair's already completely reclined. <laughs> <laughs> Michael's basically he's, he's basically in bed right now with a mic in his hand. <laughs> yeah, even more a fucking uh, dressing <laughs> gown. Robe, yeah. See, it's hard because now this is where he gets super stoned and he just starts disappearing into himself. <laughs> and then it's like question time, and every like, uh, and I'll be like question for. Michael and he'd be like <laughs> should we bash him should we bash him yeah. let's bash him <laughs> <laughs> just one hit each oh, oh yuck, 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 yuck 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 all right let's move on yeah fucking Matt versus Michael hit it Matt yes Matt versus Michael it's Matt versus Michael it's Matt versus Michael today Matt versus Michael it's Matt versus Michael it's Matt versus Michael today yay come 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 have fun Bottle of cum. All right, so this is a segment. Our, our, this is the most important segment of our podcast. Really? Okay? This bottle of mints right here. Okay, that's up for grabs. That's what's at stake. Right now, it's 10 5 to Michael. He leads. Every week, they must do something that tests them physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. And this week, the competition is. I don't even know yet. Really? No. Well, someone in the comments gave me this idea last week, so thank oh, you, whoever that no. was. Who's better at prank calls? Yes. Oh, Matt and yes. Ma- now you might Matt probably has a bit of an advantage right now because Michael's a bit fucking high. So um don't fuck this up, Matt yeah, Brown. Come on, Brown. How are we gonna right, So you guys are, are both gonna take my phone? You can call whoever you want. Whatever you want, like businesses, I mean, not people in oh, my contacts. Okay. <laughs> and you can fucking say whatever the fuck you want. And uh, James and I are going to judge and see how you go. Okay. Let me just put my fucking phone on song. Is this a speed thing or do they get a moment to plan? Um, the paper says rock to see who goes first. So there's probably a bit of an advantage. Michael for always them. wins this. I don't think I've ever seen Matt win the, the scissors paper think, rock. I think, did you win last week? No. Scissors <laughs> paper rock. Shit! <laughs> wow, <laughs> just it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so Michael to go first. That's why he did that outburst. He knows that's pivotal. All right, Michael. Oh, this is. I'm ex- so L- like, excited. Do, like thinking of this on like on the fly, especially after all the prank calls that we've done. This is not an easy thing. Okay, Fuck so no. this is this is going to be quite <laughs> difficult to just come up with some on the spot. And Matt's really stressing. He's going into labour. Yeah, I am a bit nervous. Why don't you speak into the mic? Uh, 
<laughs> I'm used to, I'm used to can you I, starting a boom. Can I? T- Here we go. Oh, no good, G. Can I call Mon and say you've been in a car no, accident? No, no, you have to call it business. Because I thought of that as well. I was like, I'm going to call Mon and lie. Yeah, no, I want it, I uh, want you guys to really test your um, actual prank call skills and we call someone we don't know. So they have to be creative with what they okay, prank I've, with? I've just yep. come up with yep. it. Smart, okay. I've just come up with it. Brown, you have planning time right now. Tune out. Meditate and just think of something because you can win this. He's high as fuck. Matt's mind right now is just completely swipe <laughs> slate. <laughs> just a big is this one slab private? of concrete. Yeah, yeah, I've changed it to private. <laughs> Hang on, let me just double check. Let me just double check that I have changed it to private. Because fuck me, imagine if I was just like, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to fucking kill you. <laughs> <laughs> they have my phone number. <laughs> it calls the police. <laughs> Oh, man. I'm in a building with a gun. I'm going to kill everyone here. <laughs> Dude, that would actually be the best fucking prank call. Imagine that. <laughs> my name's Julian Tennyson Woods, and I'm going to kill everyone. This is my address. <laughs> Delivery or something else. Pick up. Please say your store name or postcode. Or say main menu to go back to the main menu. Spring Hill. Please say your store name or postcode. Or say main menu to go back to the main menu. I love these things. Spring Hill. Sorry, but I am having some trouble processing your request. Let me put you through to a team member that can help. (laughs) This is Frank Paul. Welcome to Pizza Hut. Our customer service team are all on call. It shouldn't be long, so please call and we'll be right with you. For the next available agent, please stay on the line. Aspley, Aspley Shop. Pizza Hut. What the fuck? <laughs> 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 it shouldn't be long. Oh, please call and we'll be right with you. <laughs> Considering what he's saying. <laughs> oh, man. That's a 10. <laughs> that's a 10. Very, very funny. <laughs> so, Connie, just cut that down, but please leave some of that in, actually. Because <laughs> I know that's insane, but that fucking... People need oh, to hear shit. that. And we probably... There'll probably be a dip there. People trying to oh. skip past that. <laughs> so that's my prank call. <laughs> no, you're going to talk to someone. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, fuck. Um, <sighs> yeah, really, I think he was serious. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I think a prank call is. <laughs> a funny <Aspley>. song. <laughs> <laughs> That is shocking, that song. Who oh, cleared clear that on, on, on marketing? <laughs> <laughs> Which Domino's oh. pizza? Yes, here we go. Oh, yeah. Of course, they're busy. Tell me, how can I help? Hey, mate, how are you? Good, thanks. How are you? Yeah, good, thanks. Um, I was wondering if I could pick up some pizzas. Yep. Um, could I please get a Simply Cheese? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, mate. Is this is this um Pizza Hut? Oh no, this is Domino's down here. Oh, fuck. I'm I thought I'm I've got the wrong shop. I'll have to I actually want a pizza from Pizza. So you cancel that one? Yeah, cancel you're gonna have to cancel that pizza, mate. Oh no worries, thank you. That's okay, mate. Sorry. That's all right, thank you. Sorry. Have a good one. Yeah, you too, sorry. What the fuck? <laughs> you were just going to call Pizza Hut and, and say that you want a Domino's. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, thought you were gonna, it. I thought you were going to actually just order the pizza and then just end the call normally and not have any prank involved. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that would have been so <laughs> much for it. Every day. Yeah, like literally pay for it and shit and then just that's it. <laughs> oh, shit. That would have been so much better, dude. Oh, oh, brown. So wait, do we get rated out of ten or? Yeah, we'll we'll rate it after at the end. Okay. I hate having to hold this. Matt, do you want to swap chairs for this? Get a burger. Hey, hey, hey. Um, would I be able to um make a uh, pickup order, please? Yes. Oh yeah, sir. Um, I wouldn't. Uh, I wanted to get a. Uh, oh shit! Hang on. What's the name of it? 
Oh fuck! Uh, it's it starts with an F. It's like uh, it's a the not the filthy? big one. Yeah, filthy site. Yeah, yeah, it's like a filthy site. Yeah, filthy burger. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Can I get um one of those, please? Um yeah. And um and uh, there's uh they've got um they've got ingredients on it. I want to take off. Is that okay? I wanted to, there's uh onion on it. Would I be able to remove the onion, please? Oh yeah. Thank you so much. Are you still there? Okay, okay. Are you still there? Hello? Uh, yeah. Hello? Oh, sorry. I, I lost you there. What happened there? Um, I have no idea. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I have no idea. I love that saying. I swear to God, I'm going to get, have, I have no idea tattooed across my back <laughs> one day. <laughs> anyway, anyway. So can I remove the onion from my filthy thing? Uh, yeah. Yes, please. Thank you. And um, and uh, you can get filthy fries, can't you? Yeah. Oh, can, wait. Sorry. Let me just get a filthy onion. Onion. You want to know why onion on the get a filthy? Yeah, yeah. No, no filthy. wine onion and no um, um, no relish either. There's relish on it too, isn't there? Isn't there? Isn't there? No, no. Yeah. Can, can I take the relish off if there's relish on it? I don't want any of that on there. It freaks me out. Okay, there's no relish. But Excellent. And um and filthy fries. Hey, you got filthy fries? Yeah. Yeah, can Just I get fries? normal fries? Just normal fries. Just normal fries? Yes, please. Just large? Yeah, yeah, large, 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 large. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um yeah, yeah, yeah. and um yeah, that's um that's about it. Okay. So it's a get a filthy with no like diced white onion. Yep. Um okay, well, do you need my name, name or something? Yeah. Yep. Um, it is Michael Brookhouse. Michael. Michael yeah. Brookhouse. Got it. All right. Um, actually, can you just be one second? One second. Yeah. Um, sorry. This is actually a prank call by Michael Brookhouse. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Oh, snap. That was like a big snap at the end. That was pretty cool. Yeah, look, it felt like a long food rag. Yeah, I, I changed. Sorry, this is breaking in my hand. Fuck. I'm um, sorry. It, uh, ch I changed halfway through. So. Where is the phone? Where did you put it? Oh, it's in my. Oh, oh, there it is. Yeah, oh, look, man, um, that's fuck, man. That was some now, awesome. the prank is if you ever go to Get a Burger near where we live, you cannot use your full name. Never been there and never will go there. I like, don't remember him from that. <laughs> a slightly strange conversation. I'm sorry. I'll never that, forget that his was, name ever. That was rough to do. Because <laughs> oh, she sounded so nice. And I went with his bogan side. I wanted to go, I want to change it to normal. And then I was going to go normal. And then I just wanted to blame Michael for it. Anyway, let's get to the scores and stop talking about whatever the fuck just happened then. <clears throat> that means it was bad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to have to give Michael a 7 out of 10. Wow. Really? Really? 6.5. <laughs> no, I have, I'm going to stick with a 7. I'm giving you a 4, dude. Okay. It was very basic. <laughs> I think... But I'm also... I'm like, Marty's roots. a 10. You know, like, Marty's yeah. very fucking good at prank calls. And he's also that's done a 150 level. Yeah. of them. <laughs> I know, I know. But, like, that's what we have to compare ourselves to here. So yeah, man, that was oh, it was God. not great. Oh, that's a four. <laughs> All right, look, seven and a four, that makes eleven. Legs All eleven. Right. And I give Matt a um I'm gonna have to give you a five. Just for the duration, I felt myself zoning in and out and the cringe level was um Yeah. Some really um high level cringe moments and um the payoff not quite good enough to pay for all of that shit. See <laughs> There's no So I'm gonna give you a five. That's fucked. Yeah, you gave him a seven over mine. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't do anything. <laughs> yeah, but that's part of the that's part of the appeal. That's part of the joke is that his was so that's fucking shit. bullshit. I actually, I'm pretty high too now. Maybe I shouldn't have given Michael a seven. Set, like man, yeah, that's, that's he literally called bullshit that you called, gave him a seven. He called Domino's and give goes, me a five. Wait, is this about the whole nah, set though. Sorry, the that's whole it. Bit. That's all you did. No, you didn't do anything Dude, funny in it. You forgot I'm not about very the, good. You forgot about the song. How good was the song? Oh, maybe, maybe I that's can't win off the song. Moment. Maybe that's what I it was. Knew that, that I was the that pizza. No, you didn't. He had no idea See, that, that was. No, the I've pizza had pizza up before. I don't know get a burger, but and I've that's had pizza. not a prank call. It's just a song we had to wait for, which we were fine. We enjoyed that. You were dancing. 
Oh, the Snap song back to is, the Moroccan dancing yeah. by James. The song's one of the best things that's ever happened to me. That was incredible. Yeah, maybe you I was just in a good- You can't give him just, any points for the song. That's not fair. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, no, you're right. Maybe I'm being biased. We should have written these in down such a too, laughing. because now in my head, I know the score that I have to give Matt in order to win or lose. Yeah, true. It's tough. Yeah, fuck. Yeah, I, look, I don't know. And I, it's very hard to judge because they were both, I feel like the creativity level was both equally shit. <laughs> but one was really short and one was incredibly long and you sort of was just like where's he going with this yeah I fucking changed it in my head I really <laughs> it's hard do you do that change on the spot well yeah, oh, yeah. sometimes you gotta like make well, shit up on the fly bro I was gonna go something along like yeah, yeah fuck it's hard to judge I, I'm really worried about Man, that look you know what I'm gonna actually remove myself from this judging process for this week because I'm too high to know what's going on and I'm going to rest it solely on James's shoulders. <laughs> oh. All right, James, what do you pick? Well, maybe if, what's another way that we can vote? Or should we have a tiebreaker situation or you something? You can give it to the fans if you I'm want. I'm wondering if we need a tiebreaker because it's very hard to separate. Why don't we give it to I the fans? I reckon Matt would have had it. For me, what spoiled it for me it was, right at the end was you just saying, this is a prank call. So oh, like I that wanted ruined to it for me. No, but I'd already gone through, so I didn't want it. I know, but I don't know. Because that, with um, that took oh. for some reason it took took, took away from it for me. Really? Yeah. Um, oh no! Tiebreaker. Tie tie break. Break. Listen, Listen to this. I love this. Listen to this. We need a tie. I am going to call any business. I'm not going to tell you guys, and you guys both have to work in tandem, and we're going to see who's funnier. Um, here during this call, so James and I are going to say nothing. I'm going to call a random business, and you and Michael have to converse with these people. And um, yeah, make something up. Here we go. Um, well, do you just want to leave it to the fans? This is going to take too long. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, this won't take long. Good evening. Thanks for calling Reading Cinema. This is Kate. Hey, Kate. Um, I'm just wanting to find out if actually, actually, Ben, can you take this over? Ben, I have no idea what it is. <laughs> Michael Brookhouse. Um, what times uh, Guardians <laughs> of the Galaxy 3 on? Michael Brookhouse. Pardon? What times Guardians of the Galaxy 3 on? Today? Yeah. <coughs> Michael, Michael Brookhouse. 8.30. 8.30. All right, well... <laughs> Michael Brookhouse. All right, we'll get two tickets to that one, please. Um, so I can't book that one over the phone. Um, you either have to book on. <sighs> oh, oh shit. that's boring. All right, well we'll we'll hit that. Why had no? Why we'll can't you have up. a better system, please? Michael Brookhouse. My name is that's Michael Brookhouse. My brother Bill. Sorry. Pardon? Sorry, there's just two voices, so I couldn't make that one out. Oh yeah, that's right. We'll look them up. We'll look them up ourselves and book them online. Look up Michael Brookhouse. Thank you. Thanks for your help, Ted. Yeah. You've been great. Look That's me right. up. I'm Just look me you. up. Bye. Look me up. Sorry. Michael Brookhouse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Look. Um, <laughs> we actually didn't do too bad ago. I thought we'd suck. <laughs> what do you think, James? It's very, it's very hard <laughs> judging, isn't it? Because like Michael didn't technically do anything funny, but then Matt just did the same yeah, I, thing I again. That that's exactly what I thought was going to happen. Someone's going to set up, and someone's going to be hilarious. Yeah, and I just yeah. Well, Michael, def if that's your <laughs> definition, like Matt. No, no, I. Great. Is that your definition of that prank call? Because if that is the case, <laughs> Michael did set up, but you were not hilarious. No, I'm just saying that's what would happen when you do. <laughs> if that's what you're saying, the prank call is. <laughs> Then Michael I, Brookhouse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just kept saying his name. Okay, so oh. all right, look, what's the tiebreaker? Does it does it pull it more in his way or my way? Who wins? Sorry. <laughs> it's tough. Fuck man. It is hard, isn't it? <laughs> look, I'm I'm gonna give it to Matt. Wow. And no. I'll tell you why. I'll okay. tell you why. It's just because you you were a really good wingman, but that wasn't the project. The project wasn't to make him funny, it was to make you funnier. Matt had a go at being funny. He I'm not good at it. Yeah. 
but six, hey, it's hard to think of prank calls on the spot. I don't know how you do it, dude. You've, yeah, you've he's, gone it's, up he's to a six prodigy. Now. I, my oh. issue when I was younger is I could not not laugh. I could be doing the shittest prank call and I would piss myself laughing. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 know, I used to call I people giggles. all the time and fuck around. Yeah, oh, I, <laughs> dude, Luke prank called his dad one night. <laughs> really, it was incredible. <laughs> and he picked it straight away, <laughs> and Luke was so embarrassed. <laughs> fuck, that was funny. He was like, what? Luke. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck are you calling me for? <laughs> what was he saying was like, to no, his no, dad? No, me. I don't know. He was doing some one of those lame things, like you know, is your fridge running? Oh, that kind God. of thing. Oh, and like pretending to be someone else. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, and Noel so picked good. it instantly and was fucking mad, and it was so funny. Oh wow, dude, that would have been funny ass. <laughs> yeah, I was dying. All right, so ten mm. six to Matt. He's coming back. He's bringing it home. That's like three in a row. Is it? No, nah, two in a row. You're winning two out of every three lately. You're only Still, four weeks behind now. Four, what, we're halfway through the season almost, and he's I'm four in front. Well, we've got another four episodes, so if you measure if you won those four, you'd be even. I blame wow. weed. Yeah, yeah oh, 100%. Yeah. yeah. But I have been enjoying myself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I can afford because I was like six ahead. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, you can just so have a little holiday. I'm the, I'm the rabbit. rabbit. <laughs> I'm yeah, the rabbit. You're the, the, rabbit. the tortoise. <laughs> All right, guys, let's fucking move along. Mm. Let's move this gravy train to Matt's Tinder Adventures. Hit it, Brown. <sighs> <laughs> T-I-N-D-R We have Matt's Tinder Ha 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 Matthew Brown has lost control Now these women will lose their souls uh, Quick question Yeah, yeah. You haven't, you haven't Like no one's had a bong break Oh yeah Holy, oh, fuck. Oh, holy fuck Go Let's have a Before we get into this guys I'd prefer it if you were high So yeah. go and have a bong bong break ah! I like the way and we're you move. back. All right, there's a segment where we take Matt's Tinder. We take his, we built his own Tinder account, and we speak to the girls for him because he's really, really struggling to speak to the opposite sex. So I try and speak to these girls exactly how Matt would speak to them in real life. Matt threatened to bash girls <laughs> before, remember? Yeah, that? but I downgraded it to a. a, a <laughs> I downgraded it to a, a friendship over. <laughs> that was so Christ. good. That would be so shocking to see. <laughs> downgraded it to cutting him off. Yeah. Or bashing. I'd take a bashing before no friendship. Matt! Matt! I can make him scream. Yeah. Yeah. Matt! No! Matt! Oh, no. I can't even picture yeah, it. Anyway, right. let's yeah. fucking move on. So I've even worked my magic so well that there's now a girl that Matt could potentially go and date on Friday. The option's there. No, I don't want it. So, so this is what I mean. Like, I just get him endless amount of bird, yeah, and but he just keeps. Have you seen? No, nice I haven't seen. I haven't seen because you don't show me anything before. Yes, you know. Have you ever heard of and blind then, dates? And then, then you want as soon as you're like, oh, I think I've got it, and then you send it through, and just <laughs> that's it. And I'm like, hey, trust me, you want to see this one. I would have said no. The f I would have said no. Anyway, look. Look, look, let's move on, okay? Here, there's some promising stuff. I, and don't get me wrong, I'm not ungrateful. I just don't, I just don't think <laughs> you're- Definitely ungrateful. <laughs> no, 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 let me finish. Don't cut me off. I'm just saying, I just don't think you're looking at, at any any girls that I would be interested in. Well, I'm just, I'm just taking a wrong. large sample size. No, you're not. You're taking- And showing them all to you. And if there's one in there that matches what you want, then you pick her up with, with your little tin snips and you drop it down your asshole. Yeah. You got the biggest thumbs in history, man. Yeah, ma imagine that. that. <laughs> imagine that in your bum. Fucking oh. hell. Oh. Anyway, let's fucking let's Sorry. let's move on. All right, here we go. So, this girl Matt, Matt So, oh, by the way, I have to mention also. Obviously, I had my wedding right. and then me and Mon went on a fucking bender for 2 days. So, I haven't really again written many there's some just very short conversations. Lots of shorter conversations, but some good setups hopefully for next week. Similar to last week, but surprisingly a lot of them unmatched. Anyway, let's get yeah, into it. So, <clears throat> so Matt begins. Press your back against the wall and slide down slowly. I'm feeling pressure. That's an odd sentence to start with. Does it usually work? Does it work? My mother is not an it. She's a she. And yes, for your information, she actually just got a really good job. And she has not replied. 
<laughs> anyway, here we go. So she starts this, com- uh, this conversation. She goes, hey. Well, 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 Kai. What brings you to Tinder? I'm stretching my skin out. <laughs> it's false as hell. Not sure, to be honest, but when I find out, I'll know, lol. What brings you on here? I'm greasier than a mechanic's toothbrush. <laughs> wow, I can't believe I'm telling you this. How long have you been single for? Like four years. I broke up with my ex because she kept getting sick. It was fucking bullshit. What about you? Are you claiming? <laughs> she hasn't replied. <laughs> Oh, she kept, she kept getting sick. sick. <laughs> That's a deal breaker for Matt Brown. Uh, was she? Was she nice? Oh yeah, I guess she was kind of nice. You fucking ruin everything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this one is a continuation from last week. How are you married? So Matt, Matt starts with "Hey," and then she didn't reply, and then Matt goes. I said, hey, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> and then she replies with, hi. Oh, finally, he replied. I nearly had given up on us, Sarah. Something told me not to write you off completely, though. And then I had a dream last night. Then I checked my turn this morning and bang, there's your message. Have you? How's your weekend been? Or is it too much? Ha <laughs> ha. Hiya, lol. I replied the next day. You're the one who took ages. I had to punish you for taking so long. <laughs> it's a lot to process. And I'm not just making sure, sh- and I'm just making sure I'm not wasting my time with someone who won't put in effort for our relationship. Do you feel me? Oh my god! Yeah. Gosh. Bottle of horse. <laughs> Can you imagine? How kind are you? <laughs> A bottle of horse. Matt starts the conversation here. Very brave. Split me. You've been brushed yet? I don't even know what that means. <laughs> like, have you done your hair and shit? I'm really good at it. I used to do my mother's hair. I could come over and do it for you. Bend my fingers. It's rare I brush the mop. <clears throat> well, let me have a hack at it. I bet I'm better than any hairdresser you've been to. Scalps on my happy place and shit. You got kids? <laughs> I've got a seven-year-old boy. He has a bit of fur. I'll have a hack at that too. When's your next free time? Some more balls of shit dangled in my ass pubes. It's bullshit. She didn't write back from that, did she? <laughs> she didn't write back. <laughs> Oh, balls. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you just found them whilst typing the message. <laughs> it's all so, mood changes. Super honest. I'm at the start of this one. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry up, it's shit. <laughs> that sounds it's one. Shit. <clears throat> I'm on all fours scuttling around the house. <laughs> What's your name? Ha ha ha, why? Christina. Just trying to freak my sister out. She's blind and she literally has no idea what's going on when I do it. I pretend like I've left the house and then I stay completely silent and scuttle from side to side so she only hears my fingertips and feet scratching around. She fully gets so scared because it doesn't even sound like how any human or animal moves. <laughs> Please tell me she replied. No, she hasn't replied yet. Oh, that's recent. Oh, that's recent. Hell. It's a good setup. I'm so proud of this game. <laughs> <laughs> so proud of torturing his blood. Very yeah. so. oh, good. <laughs> um. So I'm back. So this yeah. girl shows a bit of interest. She opens the messaging with a winky face emoji. Oh. Slice me up with a branch, take me down with wire, and muscle me into a foxhole. I'll stay there and belch the alphabet. <laughs> Fucking hectic. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. Yeah. <laughs> do you want me to do you want me to read the conversation with Date Girl? No, yes. no. I don't don't line up any dates because oh, everyone let's, wants let's read that. it. Let's read it. All You're right, not allowed so to invite anyone a, here, is, and I'm not going to any dates. This is a continuation from a conversation um, from a while ago. So basically, it started with um, her saying she can tie like fucking. Something into a knot with her tongue and Matt asking her to jam the tongue into his ask. And then Matt being like, Mm. when are you next available? When can you come over? And then she just randomly replies, um, now, one day, one one morning at 1.30 a.m. Remember I showed you that, Matt? I think that was like during the Bucks. Mm. And Matt... Then, if she came then Matt replies, the fuck, I wish I saw this. What would we have done if you came over? <laughs> and she replies, no way. I would start by playing with your nipples, sucking them, blowing on them to make them extra pointy. 
I would grab your neck and lead you to the kitchen. Then I would position your head in the dishwasher and fucking slam the door shut. Then I would squeeze my balls until they popped. Ooh, now that sounds like my kind of fun. Are you free this week? I'm digging my thumbs into my cheek. I could possibly make some free time. I'm always up for a good head slamming in the dishwasher. When? I need to know when so I know when to not watch porn that day. Saturate my sack. (laughs) (laughs) Do you think Friday will give you enough time to fill up and give me a full coating of this matty juice? Something like this? Yeah, Friday's perfect. I'm just swelling with cream already just thinking about slamming the dishwasher door with all my force on your head. Seriously, though. <laughs> Let's boil on Friday night. Then- <laughs> Let's boil. <laughs> and then, and then we go on to exchange. Uh, Matt, I give her Matt's um, Instagram and Snapchat. So you're welcome, Matt. And, you know, that sounds like a bit of fun. Like, <laughs> yeah, that doesn't sound like a date. <laughs> Dishwasher. Dude, <laughs> what if you hurt her? With all your force? <laughs> it's like hurt her neck. What if there was a real dude and he was like dead serious? He's like, yeah, oh, that was my type of fun. <laughs> Like, yeah, well, that's even better. Does she now. watch the podcast? Like, <laughs> does she know, know what I don't this know. is? I honestly have no Planning idea. Planning not to watch porn. <laughs> <laughs> right. Urgently asking. <laughs> All right, now this is again a continuation from a girl. Remember, she Matt had a go. Was they were having some arguments? They were bickering a bit because Matt was saying that a good workout in the gym you need to scream. <laughs> yeah, has to be screaming, and she started getting quite annoyed. Yeah, I do remember this one. <clears throat> anyway, so it ended with. Um, her saying, "You know, I'm. I am ju- not just not interested. You seem like an ass. <laughs> Maybe I am an ass, but at least the shit pouring out of my ass is real and genuine shit. I'm not squeezing my cheeks shut and keeping all my shit inside. <laughs> I'm letting the shit throw freely and cascade out into the world. I suggest you do the same. <laughs> Good luck out there, Sammy. It's been real. A part of me will always wonder what we could have been. I love you." <laughs> Oh, did she write back? I love you. Yeah, the way you speak is not someone I want in my life, ever. I just told you I love you, and you don't want someone in your life that tells you that, and, and is honest with you about how to work out properly. <laughs> Lol, righto. Sounds like you're just after sex, and I'm not okay with that. How can you tell someone you love them oh. when you know nothing about them or met them? And I'm not after sex. Sorry, I'm a Christian, and I don't do <laughs> sex before marriage. <laughs> Love isn't always straightforward or simple, Sammy. Sometimes it's confusing and complicated. And believe it or not, I actually have massive red-hot feelers for you. And so all this bickering is actually breaking my heart. How can a Christian be so mean to someone that loves them? Doesn't fucking Jesus teach to always fucking love cunts and shit? <laughs> no reply to that. No, yeah. Will she, you reckon? Does she unmatch? I don't know. Oh, no. man. She's, oh. she's a, I'm th- thinking surely she'll Hold on to that one Because she seems to bite at everything yeah. Which is quite funny Wow that was very good This is the last one Okay Sorry <clears throat> I grant you three wishes Why three? Okay How about unlimited money Because that would remove stresses And bring freedom to my life Good physical and mental health Always for myself and family That would hopefully give us long lives To enjoy the freedom and independence Of the unrestrained finances And the ability to provide The essentials of massive theory as theory So people can achieve self-actualization Oh man, man. Shut the fuck <laughs> up <laughs> <laughs> you didn't. Oh, I didn't say that. Oh, I did. Dude. Oh. Write that now. Yeah, that is definitely the reply. That oh. was one of the best. Oh. <laughs> Let's just pretend that I did, okay? Okay. But I did say something um, weird. <laughs> anyway, she goes, you're a mean genie. <laughs> oh, if you think that's mean, wait until I tell you what I used to do to my pet seagulls. Oh, do tell. I love cruelty to animals. I would duct tape their beaks together and offer them food. <laughs> they would get so frustrated. It was fucking hilarious. It's just a joke, though. I would feed them properly after a few hours. <laughs> Are you an air sign? Leave me the fuck alone. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my was God. the last bit fake? No, no, that was actually. Leave me the fuck <laughs> 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 the opposite of 
helping, <laughs> trying to get a girl. Leave me the just fuck alone. Telling girls to leave me <laughs> the fuck alone. <laughs> oh, that, that one there, probably the best one you've done. <laughs> All right. Oh, man, that there was very fun. That's Min's Tinsel's Advances this morning. Let's move right along, everybody, to the Q. Oh, please have a fucking bong break. Yeah, not enough. But before you do, um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, give us a five star review. You see, we're on two point two now on Spotify. Really? Yeah, it's going quickly, wow. man. You fuck you guys, keep going. Okay, you smash that shit. I guess it's going in the morning. Can all that shit's demonetized, so we have to rely on you guys because there's no other way of spreading the word, Matt Brown. We're not gonna pay, we don't have money to pay for ads, to pay for marketing. What are you gonna? What are you gonna hold a post job and show to people? No. You're going to go to the concrete tower and scream at everyone. Yeah. More bong, weed. Hell bong yeah. break. No, you bong don't break. need any more weed. Bong break. Hey, mate, don't you... I'm yes, fucking... Like, you're being the, the eye of Savron. Savron? Sel, <laughs> I'm trying to connect with movies. With you. Yeah. Bong, well, bong. It worked. I got a little giggle out of that. Oh. Bong break. And we're back. All right, guys, we're going to do the Q&A now. If you want us to answer your questions, leave a comment on the Money Mock or Fully Actual YouTube channel. We answer the most liked questions first. Once you've commented your question, have a scroll through. We and have like questions the other questions. Your answers, you your answer. questions are all our answers and the answers from your Sorry, questions. Guys. From the questions and your answers, these are answers for your questions and these answers for your questions and the questions and your answers. These are answers from your questions. <laughs> Short and sweet. Yeah, just quick. <laughs> All right, Matt, what do you got, cunt? Uh, first question is from Rap Master. <laughs> um, can we get the host f- on for the Matt vs. Michael segment? Oh, yeah? Yeah, we could ask him. Fuck, that would be funny to watch, actually. He lives on the property. Is he really? I've in never car- seen him. In the caravan. I haven't seen him either. In the caravan. Seriously. <laughs> he just doesn't know how to pop it up. He can't get out because he can't pop it up. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have to meet this kind of, eh? Sorry. Uh, Go on. Next question is from Stephen Durick. Durick? Durick? Durick. Durick. Depending where he's from. Um, what is the most trouble you boys have ever been in with your parents? Um, fuck. Would have been a heap of trouble at school all the time. Mum would hate it when the principal called. She'd yeah, she really said that in your upset. in her wedding speech. That yeah, she'd really get upset because she'd be just so embarrassed because the principal would just be saying how much of a cunt I was <laughs> at school. <laughs> and mum would just be like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then I'd get fucking screamed at straight after. But anyway, that's You can't probably- think of any, Michael. You were like school captain, good boy. I was school captain in primary school. I've never said that before. But really? I um, <laughs> said it about 50,000 times, gone. <laughs> and um, then I got caught. One time I was with a friend and we snuck out onto a roof of a primary school and we smoked cigarettes. And then the police came and took us back to my house. You know? <sighs> Ooh. Really? You would have gone in heaps of shit? Yeah, yeah. Or are you lying? No, that's real. Trespassing and... I don't know, we were kids, so they let us off lightly, but it was scary. My parents were very upset. What about you, Matt? This would be fucking good. Oh, I got done for underage drinking. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Oh, but you, didn't your parents not find yeah, out? You, you, you got away with twice. that. The one I got away with. No, I did not. Well, you, I got away with it once too. Well, they didn't get the really and everything. They didn't get really angry. They sent the fine to the house. Yeah, that's and what. I, I, and I, I caught it. Same thing happened. Yeah. To me. See, the first one I caught it, but then the second one I opened it up and left it in my room. And Mum was like, "What's this? This is so disappointing. What are you doing?" Can't be doing that. What did you say to it? <laughs> Fuck off, mum. <laughs> yeah. I just said sorry about that. <laughs> sorry. Uh, what about you, James? Oh, James, this is the yeah, parents. I know, Your parents Shit. don't know the greatest sin you've ever committed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe not. The cow was yeah. like up there with the funniest story I've ever heard. Is it a sin if you don't mean it, though? I'm yeah, not sure. No. It's not it's cow but, um, it's No, mine of- is easy. That was when um I got that. I got... um like a bodily harm charge because Luke and I egged this bike rider and he got our number plate. But that's not the part I got in trouble for. This was years later. I got in the most trouble as a kid when I was 17. 
I was like old, but I was working at the fucking- Is this when your dad walked out? Yeah. <laughs> I was working at the video shop. Not the one that I worked up with Matt, the one before that. Yeah, video dad shop. showed up to my shift and I was, I was like 17. I can walk myself home. I live just up the road. So I was just like, dad. And he was like, I'm going to stand outside until you finish your shift. And then we're going to walk home together. And you're going to tell me about your bodily harm charge. And I was like, oh, oh, oh and my, like, my God. dad never gets mad. And he was fucking pissed. He had like a, he had an umbrella too. I like was, I was like, he's, he's going to bash me with that on the way home. Whoa. Yeah. It was an intense walk home. Yeah. But, uh, but, it's not that bad. And once I think once I explained to him that I was like, I egged someone and I just didn't want to tell you guys because I was embarrassed. I paid the fine and moved on. And he was like, he was far less angry then. I think he thought I oh, like, was like oh, yeah, getting in yeah, brawls Yeah, you probably shit. thought that you'd fucking beaten this shit yeah, out of something. Yeah, mm. <laughs> It would be in the moment though. It'd be terrifying to see your dad. Oh, We're yeah. We're walking home together. I was like, oh, oh yeah. He was, he was scary. And your dad speaks <laughs> really well. So yeah. a disappointed guy. Such a lovely, be... gentle man. I think that's yeah. why when I saw him talk to me like that, I was like, Whoa. How long till the end of your shift? Imagine if he was there for five hours. <laughs> yeah, it's <laughs> like stalking you through the window. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> As cracking his knuckles and shit. Yeah. As asleep because he's just so tired and being so angry for so long. <laughs> oh. no, it was like five or ten minutes. He, he, yeah, to see him angry would scare me because he is such a sweet man. Yeah. I remember you told me a story how a guy nearly. Really, like you, you like drive through a crosswalk oh, and nearly hit yeah, your sister. I remember that. And how angry he was. And I was like, God, that would. Booted a fucking massive dent in the side of their car. Yeah, just. <laughs> just yeah. walk down the road because they parked the car and you just boom, kick the door and put a big dent in it. Because this guy nearly ran over my sister and he like chased us down the road and dad just like ignored it. He's like, What's your name? You're going to pay for my car. And dad just ignored him and just kept walking. <laughs> And eventually just gave up and went away. <laughs> oh my God, that's crazy. Yeah. He just gave oh, up. Oh, wow. Yeah, because I think that dude knew he would have lost that fight. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. Oh, and then what, you never, were you scared that your parents were going to find out about the cow? Um, I, th I used to care about that. Yeah, you used to hide that. And now it's sort of just funny that they don't know. So I just, I just never brought it up. Maybe I'll tell Kaz one day. Maybe when James is married, we should say it at the wedding. Yeah, That's that'd be funny. The wedding story. <laughs> yeah. James, James has killed a cow. It, or it yeah. definitely broke its femur. <laughs> <laughs> just like Greg. <laughs> and he's like... <laughs> oh, fuck. All right, man. Uh, what's next, Colin? Um, Milking Stool Patrick did ask um, can we get the fans to decide a movie for Michael to review well if you fucking reviewed a movie for once hey maybe he did, it. He did watch it did. maybe you do it but yes yeah, send your suggestions through because I'm happy to throw them out there if they're yeah if comment they're whatever you reckon a lot of people do already um, a lot of people really do already but a lot of them Michael's already seen and he either enjoys or hates it I'm trying to find things he's never watched before yeah it's one way or the other with you isn't it it's hardly I think it's like a 99% miss rate with Matt's movies no but you like you love it or it's fucking trash. There's I'm nothing in between. Or yeah, I just or I think you've it. got no culture. <laughs> wow. Look, I fucking played tennis all through my teens. That's, mate. Not, that's not culture. <laughs> yeah, that's why you got no culture. Every weekend I was at a tournament. I'd come like fifth. So sixth he's been sometimes. around. He's been around. <laughs> It's great. Next question is from Jay Sean. Uh, is Brown still making mince deposits in the bottle? Not current, yeah, not at the no, moment. No, not. It hasn't. It's kind of been it's, the, the liquid gas gone. It's hard to open. Like oh, I'm scared. Yeah. I'll open it and pass out, and they'll find me the next day dead. What's happening in there scientifically? Yeah, someone's like, someone must the... have squeezed it and then put the lid back on from last time. Maybe do you reckon? I don't know. Maybe people come in every now and then and just play with it. I don't know. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> next oh, question. Wee. It's from Horror Vamp. How can Michael eat dog shit but not taste breast milk? <laughs> Great question. Yeah, I thought about it today. I probably wouldn't eat fresh dog shit again. Because <laughs> well, you could probably get sick from it. Well, we Dude. did Google it, but like there was, yeah, it did, there wasn't anything too alarming. Okay. Desperate times. I'd, actually, actually I would do it measures. again. Yeah. <laughs> Man. Yeah, we'll do it. We're filming a new little style of um, content where we just kind of do like top five times we been arrested top five 
grossest videos we've done so they'll be on YouTube um, soon and also James has a fucking new Instagram oh yeah it's James underscore okay where he'll be it's posting it's James Lee underscore it's James Lee underscore where he'll be posting behind the scenes shit of all the fucked up shit that we do and also his chinny gym videos and fucking other funny shit cunt yeah I thought it was a good idea because currently the Instagram I have is literally just like photos of me and my mates and my, my girlfriend and yeah it's too personal yeah. I like to have a different one as well so yeah it's, and like I, I, I feel like the we, we take heaps of good footage that they that everyone would be interested in. So, yeah, give it a little follow. I think it'll be a, a good time. Yeah, Some fun. good behind-the-scenes shit. Yeah. Plus <clears throat> Chinny Jim. And cleanups. I'm going to oh, put yeah. footage of that shit because I feel like it gets left out of the website videos and it needs to be acknowledged. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, true. the man. The cleanups man. are fucked sometimes. <laughs> and, like, incredible. It's yeah. like you need to see. It's like, we I reckon I should mess. start one of the, you know those, have you seen that TikTok that mows people's lawns? Oh, yeah. I should do that. Yeah. There's another guy oh, who- I'm going to give you a free clean. There's shit and piss and vomit <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> Bam, it's fixed. And there's a guy who does pools and he's got like 15 million right? followers. Yeah. I'm going to be the clean man. He cleans pools. Yeah, he cleans pools. It looks like really well. <laughs> He'll leave his concrete tower. <laughs> so, but our pool's not like, they're like, he goes like swamp looking fuck things and turns oh, into- Oh, yeah, I've seen that. To beautiful yeah. pools. Does sound interesting. <laughs> anyway, yeah. sorry. Next question is from J C Pablo. Um, next bender, um, can we strap a GoPro to Michael and let the magic unfold? Yeah, fuck, Hail fuck, to the king of rats. Fun. That would be fun, except yeah. like it's just the only reason we don't They're film personal, much. We don't film much of our when we have our boys trips and shit is because a lot of our friends aren't used to being on camera and like if so there's a camera in your face it's kind of like you're very aware of it and it's just kind of changes and people the, act differently yeah exactly people just changes the atmosphere a bit yeah. so we just like to just chill and not have to worry about that to make it even more enjoyable but we'll tell you guys in vivid detail what Matt does is, yeah. is that at a boys trip he wants that to happen yeah, yeah, the yeah, next bender yeah. alright man imagine that bender when we went away to the mountain Imagine the box. Oh yeah, just be visioning. Yeah, the box on and everything. The box would be perfect. Yeah, the box would be good. Oh, Actually, man. the box might. So be many bad. benders. Would if be. we, we had footage probably... of Luke slopping <laughs> that that drink onto Michael's back, he Fuck, was man <laughs> accurate. I'd watch that on repeat. Michael just fucking like a little rat. He knew <laughs> that because it was, it was higher no than the rock. <laughs> instinctively, that yeah, that, that was, was a good so chance. Dark. Was gonna, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so dark, so we had to like carefully scuttle over these massive rocks. Luke, Luke just slops ready. the water straight away. The little rat runs and the hawk attacked. <laughs> and he got you. Did I scream? <laughs> Biggest question is... No, you just you were kept still on trying running. to escape. <laughs> Biggest question is, why didn't you just go through the room? I don't know. You just sort of go <laughs> with so whatever. I'm so glad you didn't. Yeah, what do you think's you, the best? Boom, boom, yeah. boom, boom. It's like a big song. But I just thought of a new channel called Bender Boys. Oh, and man. We, oh. we just... We strap GoPros to our heads and then we party for weeks on end. That would then- be fun maybe 10 years ago, but now, man, <laughs> yeah, no. we'd fucking, I'd be dead within three months. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, anyone wants to start it, we'll fund it. <laughs> Pender boys. And you just put a go, dude, we'd be, there'd be so many funny things oh, uh, that we would catch if we did that our whole lives. Fuck. We'd be fucking, we'd be king and queen of this country. <laughs> oh, <laughs> probably. Next question is from Jared. Um, have you boys ever considered buying Matt a wife from either Asia or Russia? Oh, yeah, Would bad. you do that? Do they, is that still a thing? I wonder how much that is. Because if that's not that much, we should seriously, I'm going to write that down. Fuck. Would, would you, you do, do it? it? Fuck no. What oh, about it's a real- such a fun vlog Real to beautiful girl. I can tell he's like, he's not, he didn't oh. like- Aggressively say no. Yeah, because so I, 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 it'd be interesting to have them the come process, here for a week. The process would be so yeah, cool. See, you seen that that's, doco? That's what I'm thinking. Like the process. Louis Theroux does a doco on it. It's I'd yeah, love to do that with thing. you, Brown. We go yep. and find you a wife Absolutely. in find Bangkok. Matt a wife. Yeah, let's do it. That. We're gonna find out a fucking wife oh, in Bangkok. Oh, I love that. Great idea. Whoever that was, who was it? Jared. Jared. Right. Thank you, Jared. All right. Would you do that, Matt? Would you actually commit to the marriage? Look, what about we do a trial run? She lives with you for three months. She doesn't get anything. No you can sex, cut though. it off if you want. Not allowed to have sex with her, though. Mm. Well, we'd have to go to Thailand to do that, though. I don't think they, like... You can bring them back, but you oh, have to go over there for the whole process. Oh. oh, so we can't get a male, like a Russian, to come here and... Maybe, but I would have thought from what Louis Theroux showed in his doco, they go there, they like do this huge questionnaire with you and then they give you multiple matches and you go on multiple dates and then you pick one. 
Oh, wow. Wow, that does sound... Yeah. Uh, I reckon... Wait, we'll just buy a wife? We'll go man. in September. You must feel so no. much better. You can actually just go and fucking buy one. Holy shit. I never even considered that. You don't need to go out and meet women. You just go and buy them. Go and buy a wife. <laughs> Matt, are you going to... Do you Sell some of your one? basketball cards. Start Goodbye writing your two. vows. Go buy a Russian person and a, and a Thailand lady. Wow. Have multiple choice. <laughs> you would love that. He's gone quiet and he's shaking his head because he knows he has to, but deep down he loves the thought of that. Multiple choice. Next question is from Sam. <laughs> Sam Petroni. Um, can you show us uh, any videos you took in high school? Do you have any footage from high school? There were no phones. Made? There was like yeah. the fucking flip phones. We're fucking old as shit. There was no... Like people just can't... Uh, the, like I can't even remember a time without having a camera in your hand. But Oh man, there were no, it, they were the days, I'm telling you what. Literally just never had a phone in my hand. I would leave my phone at home because it was so like... You go to school to talk yeah. to people. There's no texts to read. There's no notifications yep. from Facebook or anything. I'd go home and then Fully use my the fucking hand. I took those wind-up um, cameras. You know, the wind-up oh, yeah, yeah. film cameras to we, Mexico. So remember, even that long ago, really? no iPhone. Oh, I remember yeah. the days. Remember the days when Matt Brown didn't have a phone? And he was all like, hey guys, hey, how you going? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And he was always, he'd always wave from a great distance. Matt, now Matt Brown is just, I've always had a phone Matt Brown thing. is just like, like Only in the last five Matt years Brown Matt's had just, a phone He's there Hang on You're overselling this That's not what it is It's when I sit next to you And we play Fortnite That's when I choose my he time He lies so cute too Have you seen it? Like a little mermaid Like yeah. this Just with <laughs> <laughs> Really? Yeah. I haven't noticed you'll, that. you'll see It's so cute <laughs> Yeah Matt Brown Without I'd a probably phone probably do that If I had this couch to myself I remember, I remember those man. days. It was so awesome. cool not having a phone. I, like, honestly, ride your bike. Oh, That's all I'd yeah. do every weekend. Yep. Then go play, like, hide and seek. So oh. much sport. The only thing that I don't Early like about it is that is that we fucking would have so much funny fucking footage, yeah, imagine. man. God, we used to... We so much dumber and stupider and did the dumbest shit back then. Yeah, Fuck, yeah, do you, you remember don't think a couple of, the of videos? Slash reward remember the all. birthday video we made for Cassie, oh, us man. and Henry? And then we, like, just flashes of our dicks in it and shit. Like, it was just <laughs> yeah. fucking intense. Couldn't do that these days. No. Yeah, that <laughs> oh was a God. good birthday video. But, like, whenever we did have, have a camera, we just did the film most fucked shit. I mean, Henry used to do, like, we called it Jack, Jack House or Sketch House or something. A cross between Jackass and Skit House. Remember the show Skit, skit oh, House? Oh, I remember yeah. Skit House. So skits and yeah. like stunts and shit. And we had a, yeah, man, no editing or anything. We just used to walk around and film each other on trolleys. and Some of the early days I used to oh. watch you, because Snapchat's been around for so long. I remember you guys would send Snapchats to people oh like before my God. you started filming. So and they were cringe. out of control. <laughs> Like dicks and <laughs> assholes, and I would have this. I went through this period where to make Michael laugh, I'd go out. We'd go out and get fucking hammered. Come home at like four a.m. And be like, oh, you should like Snapchat some people. <laughs> I'd get Michael to film me, and I'd send like do the most fucked shit, naked. and with my dick and shit, just really <laughs> fucked up shit, and then send them to like it's the. <laughs> people that I sent it to that would make Michael laugh because I sent it to like <laughs> old high school friends that you sort of didn't really know or speak to like people that would just be really shocked to see that it was so it was so intense. I remember and then I remember waking up my roommate Pepper I'd just like wake up like oh fuck because I'd sent Pepper them like Pepper don't just don't just I have to run out every now and then and tell her not to watch oh my god <laughs> <laughs> so cringe that I did that shit, man. So <laughs> like, what a laugh. Because, like, so, like, 20, like, really inappropriate chicks that I barely, or, like, knew or had spoken to. Just really <laughs> fucking <laughs> cringy. Yeah. Oh, I'm not, like, sexual at all. It was all just really gross <laughs> and, like, yeah. like, fucking crazy. Making strange sounds and, like, <laughs> galloping to the, <laughs> towards the phone. <laughs> 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 just shit like that. <laughs> we can we can end it there. That's very good. All right, yeah. Fucking fucking come. All right, let's move right along to the Mimi movie reviews. Brown, hit that spit. Oh fuck! Here we go. All right. Oh, is this still the same one? Yeah. Matt's got a movie for Michael to review. Matt's father's name is Greg and Michael would rather be dead. This is Michael's movie reviews. 
<laughs> I thought he was laughing. I, I going, Do you need notes or are you just going to I know wing all it? about this shit. All right. You didn't watch it, did no, you? I did. I you did didn't not watch, watch the movie. <laughs> <laughs> What's the point? Fuck the segment off then if you're not going to watch it. What a waste. No, no, I did. No, that was a lie. No, I don't want to hear it. No, Move I actually on. did. He did. He told it's me It's time for prank it. call. Uh, where is it? Uh, Your time uh, is there for... <laughs> now, okay. Which one did you watch, Michael? Uh, the American Beauty. Oh, great film. Yeah, it was not watch, bad. He didn't watch American Beauty. Kevin Spacey was great. And he didn't watch Have American you not Beauty. seen that? Yeah, it's a very good movie. He didn't watch American Beauty. No, I watched LA Confidential. Oh, LA Confidential. Did you watch both? Because you've had two to watch. No, I only watched LA Confidential. I did not have time right. for fucking Blue Crush. Okay. It wasn't Blue <laughs> Crush, it was Point Break. Same thing. Now, this is you basically got me to watch a shit version of The Departed. It is like that has B B grade departed level movie. The Departed is okay. And gangster films, as I've said before, with the whole bad cop, good cop, detective shit. Fuck off. I'm, You've got no shit. culture. No, it's shit. I'm over like... I'm swirling a It was wine. two hours and 30 minutes, dude. Oh, like, yeah. It it's, was so... It was three films in one. I don't remember being that long. Oh, dude. It, I was mad. I, did, I fell asleep three times. Amber woke me up. And I sort of get mad at her because I had to watch this fucking piece of shit film. <laughs> <laughs> so like, yeah, you made it a rough night. The Tell movie, me something about it. Okay, uh... Mr. Cosmos, the, the name that they say all the time. Rolo Tomasi. Yeah, there you go. Same thing. <laughs> Mr. So, Cosmos. Close. That <laughs> How did you is know shit. what you meant by that? The whole twist at the end when the warden from The Longest Yard comes in and you said shot. this already and you said you didn't watch it at that point. So I want to uh, hear something else. Did I've you seen, watch it? Uh, how they compete and there's that prostitute that they both fuck and then they sort of become friends at the end. It was a long, long battle, dude. It was shit. It's really bad. Did you enjoy Danny DeVito? That was the best part, but he died, and I was like, oh. Yeah. So Spoiler. you like Danny DeVito? He loves Danny DeVito. I love Danny DeVito. Yeah, okay. he's fucking be fun to have around. Always yeah, sunny in Philadelphia. Just great kick show. him in the back. Or just see how far you can throw him, hammer throw style. <laughs> yeah, spin around him. at great speeds and launch him anyway. <laughs> so yeah, this is just another film that you've given me that I can see you thinking so artsy and wow, look at all the shots. Look at how they're like the time that it was. F- Filmed 1997. It's culture, doesn't it, Matt? It's so bad, dude. It's you just, shit. You can't enjoy things. It's quite sad. <laughs> dude. Your, your favorite film We is... were talking about a film just before. What? Fucking, um... Oh, it's gone Brain now. damage. Brain damage. Apocalypto. Great film. <laughs> oh, the, the Midsummer. you guys were talking oh, about. Oh, Midsummer. Midsummer. Great yeah. film. We agree on sometimes. Well, I only sometimes agree on the good agree. ones. These ones are shit. I'm going to say about 28% you and me agree on. What? What do you give it? That's because out? you like all the movies that Michael likes because he likes so yeah, few. Yeah, I, I reckon there's, I reckon there's maybe like two. Is there any of, movies that Michael likes that you? Yeah, don't? I really don't think there could be. Michael likes strange Sandlot Kids. Do you I like love that? Love the Sandlot oh, okay. Kids. Fucking amazing. Michael. Yeah, it's very good. <laughs> do you like Stand by Me? Yes, very yeah, good. Yeah, great movie. Do you Sad like too. Without a Paddle? Yeah. Do you like is that good? I, I haven't it. seen that. Oh, oh it, it might not hold up now, but it was hilarious when I was a kid. Do you like the travel pants of the sisterhood? The sisterhood of the traveling pants. Yeah. Yeah, it's all right. It's cute. Dude, I'd never watch that. I just wanted to set you up. Have you oh seen Bushwhacked? Do you remember Bushwhacked? No. Yeah, I do. What is that about again? <laughs> it's great. What's that about? Um they Who's that? It's a squ- a scout group who go into for a wilderness trip and they think they're getting matched up with like an incredible scout leader, but it's actually a convict yeah yeah it's who's a convict. Run away from prison. That's right. And then there's a scene where they they all piss off the edge and it's and they end up pissing on the people and the dudes yeah. like oh get that they get that get Michael yeah. to watch that fuck yeah. that is old that does sound good yeah, he likes yeah, that. I mean, he might actually yeah he'll like it I reckon who's the like, bad guy it's who's, who's the guy Daniel Lloyd isn't it <laughs> yeah it's I Daniel Lloyd yeah. children's movie oh dude <laughs> the Goonies all that shit oh, so the go- good. you like the Goonies. Goonies, I like but you the, don't uh, like Back to the Future. It's uh, bizarre. I got into the Goonies when I was like 19 years old. <laughs> What's your favorite movie, Billy Madison? Billy Madison is probably or the Titanic. best film. No, no. Titanic. What's Tom Green's or good song, uh, movie? Uh, Freddie Got, got fingered, fingered is a masterpiece in its own right. 
See, this is where his problem is. Guilty. I haven't seen it's that good. either. Oh, you haven't seen that? Oh, dude, no. it's, it's very oh, good. I don't know. We, yeah, when he said, I, I would love to watch that when we've had a bit of weed. Yeah, yeah. 100%. Yeah. Because it, 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 it's old too. You'll, you, the comedy is always different. So yeah, it gets very Big Daddy, Daddy as well. Yeah. Big Daddy's a great yeah, comedy. Big Daddy's very yeah, good. Yeah, it is. But good. you like comedies. You like Marty. Marty likes a certain type This was too detective. It's too like, oh. Because you wouldn't watch you have to Detective think film, so would much. You? It was no, so. I know rough. you love a Will Ferrell I hate action comedy. shit. You can literally yeah. pick the plot so ten minutes hey, in. Yeah. I fucking hate it. Every time there's a love interest. You're, you're a bit even fucking. What was that Tom wide. Cruise movie? That yeah, yeah top, probably. Uh, I'm probably wider than Top Gun that. Two. Yeah. Within ten minutes, when he spoke to that guy in the bar, uh, um, who ends up saving his life yeah, at the end. Right. You you can immediately pick it. Like I literally said to him, that guy's going to have a pivotal role right at the very end of the movie. Of course, and sure it's enough, saves Goose. his fucking life. It's the son it's of the Goose. same shit though. It's the same fucking format every time. So there's no <laughs> excitement that you know what's going to happen. Lord you know he's going to survive. Good. Yeah, oh good. man, fucking action movies. That's Cast why I liked Game good. of Thrones so much. Because fuck, you never knew what was going to happen yeah. in that show. Yeah, I Did you like that. Game of Thrones? Holy I shit. I've only watched you'd it get into that, I reckon. Yeah, I feel like I would too. <laughs> mm. From is letting me down lately. No, I liked the last episode. It's okay. Yeah, we'll I've only see. watched the I'm first only third. like six episodes in, so I'll give it a bit more of a shot. Man. I want more zombies though. More yeah, of those no. monster things. I agree. 28 Days Later, greatest zombie film ever made. Banger. Yeah. I don't know if it's the greatest it's ever made, but it is very, very good. It is. Watch that high and you will never, ever, ever come down. Shaun of the Dead. Do you like Shaun of the Dead? Yeah, I fucking good, love Shaun Good of the film, Dead. but yeah, like, so. it's just sort of like a that play is on actually all the zombie a fucking film. Even Dawn of the Dead that. when they were in the like shopping mall. That seemed like fun. Yeah, right? I like Shaun. I like I Dawn of the Dead. As a kid. Yeah. Anyway, well, I'm getting very. We're movies. being movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah sorry. Right, yeah, but sorry about that. Fuck me. I don't know. Matt, you fucking took over for a bit. Yeah, that's what I do. But oh. the, it's so good that we watch that you watch Ali Confidential because there's an actor in that, an Australian actor, not Russell Crowe, not Guy Pearce, another Australian actor, <laughs> right? Fuck, who's know. in that film that's connected to James Lee. Oh, the Simon Baker. Simon Baker is in it. He dies. Simon Baker is in it. <laughs> he nearly got this. <laughs> and Simon <laughs> Baker and James Lee almost had a fucking fight. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was less me. It was more my mate. Yeah, but, but I backed you in that yeah. for sure. That's Sorry. a story for another time. <laughs> so, all right, let's fucking. We've been going for. So a, next movie is again. Blue Crush. Yeah, I'll watch it next week. It's Point Break, and anyway. All right, so Michael must watch Point Break. Hey, what do you give that movie out of ten? Man, a two, one, one. All right, there you go. I think I'm gonna do it to a one. <laughs> Dude, it right. was so shit. All right, um, fucking now. What, what does he have to watch next week? Point, Point Break. break. Blue Crush, same thing. Point break. All right, All right so, so Blue film. Crush. I guarantee I'll fucking hate this. It will be so bad. I can guarantee it too. <laughs> yeah. We'd have better movies for you if you actually watched these at the start. I mean, I haven't seen it, but it, isn't it like fucking surfing and crime? Yeah. He hates both those things. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to make for a very good review next week. Anthony Kiedis does make an appearance. Oh, okay. We are going to do our P.O. box right now, okay? Where you can send us shit that we open live on the podcast, right? We do not know what is in these packages. If you want to send us shit, send us a P.O. box 256 Takem, 4018 Queensland Australians. And please send us some hair so we can continue to fill that Matt's pubic hair that we're going to put on him at the, on the season finale. As you can see, wow. it's starting to fill. I have a feeling... Pubes? Maybe. Yes. It's something. Yes, guys. Keep the pubes coming. Oh, think of the pubes. It'll be so much funnier than Hang the on. pubes are. Uh, what did you just say about the pubes? Send us pubes. Yeah, why? It's for fun. Yeah, but what did you say is going to happen with them? Oh, wow. We got money. Put them on, Matt. Yeah, when? Oh, wow. It's an American $1 note. I don't know about that. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, really? We got an so, American $1 note. Dear Marty and Michael. Fuck. Put that into fucking Bitcoin. I hope this letter finds you both doing well. I'm writing to express my admiration of your incredible content. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> your videos have brought me countless hours of entertainment and laughter. I would be honored if you could provide me with an autograph. Okay, so we've got to sign this picture. Right, and well, then Matt, he's got some note thing. Oh, shit. Did I just rip something up that wasn't meant to? You just started... <laughs> Did you rip that? I think that's the return oh, fucking shit. envelope. I just started fucking fiddling and ripped it. Did I? This is why we can't have nice things because you guys break them all. We just sticky tape. I'll sticky we'll tape it. It's fine. It's fine. Can you sign it and oh, then shit. make sure this gets to Mr. John. I thought this was the rubbish. I thought this is what the letter came in. Kevin, I, I can see why you meant that. We mistake. can do that for you, Kevin. Thank you for your support. It's and a beautiful a picture. picture of us that you've chosen. We will do that. Thank you, Kevin. All right, Matt. What do you got? 
scary when it's a big package. Yeah, it could literally be anything. We've been sent some could fuck be a pipe shit. bomb. Oh, says Lil Nitro, the world's <laughs> hottest gummy bear. Oh, for fuck's sake. People love seeing the brown consume hot chilies. Fucking hell. I don't know. If Look, it's in the it brown. In Do you want some help massive. opening it? Why is it so fragile? Do you want some help opening it? Because you've got the UFC gloves on? Yeah. Dude, if you Man. do that, we'll give you this. Thorough wrapping. Up. You could put that in a bank, you know. Interest rates. Holy I think. Fake. All right, so this, <laughs> this guy's is the world's <gasps> hottest chili, chili oh, gummy bear. Dude. And it looks fucking terrifying. Little nitro. Oh, no. The world's good time, hottest gummy bear. What do you think, Matt Brown? I think I like the box and we should keep it in the box. We can keep the box. Why don't you just, ha- why don't you just have a nibble of it? <laughs> or at least a smell. Let's just get it out and have a whiff of it, eh? Yeah, come on, let me have a little help you. I'd do it, but I'm a guest and you do not treat guests that way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you fucking... Oh. Matt loves his stickers. God, is that a sticker? I don't know. Yeah. That is so fucking mad. So Love stickers. Oh, <laughs> think yeah. stickers are the best. Yeah, I've been really getting into stickers lately. Really? Oh. Yeah. Send me your stickers. <laughs> I can oh, send yeah. me send your stickers. Send some stickers. Yeah, I'd love some stickers. I, Nothing I mean, rude, but just send me some stickers, eh? Okay. It's not a sticker. <gasps> oh, it's not oh. a sticker. Damn. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's pull it out. Let's yeah. thought that they could be a sticker. Right, it looks so, fucking so, deadly. I don't know. Can, let's just open up. Where's I want to have a smell Scoville of it. rating. Yeah, give me the rating is. of heart attack. Can I just have a smell of it, Matt? James, James, please. Find it doesn't me. say. That, that, that's not good. <laughs> you know what? It does say that it's flammable. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean it's flammable? It says, oh, shit. Oh, wow. The next experience for those who seek the heat. Oh. Lil Nitro has a signature 9 million Scoville rating. What does that mean? I don't know. Hot as fuck, I suppose, is what yeah. it is. Nine, 9 million. I think so. Could be yeah, mild. That's what it says right there. Could be mild, Brown. I've got to stop eating stuff that comes through the mail. It's, it's not only, good. Oh, it's not that bad. It's only 900 times hotter than a jalapeno. Oh, 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 oh okay. is that it? Oh, I might have it then. I actually, no, nah, you have it. Sprinkle it on your salad. Matt's got it in his little pink oh, hands. God, that's hot. <laughs> yeah, smell it. It's smell hot. It kind of clears the sinuses. <laughs> yeah. Suck it up your nose. <laughs> I would imagine snorting the world's hottest gummy bear. Ah! Yeah, it's fine. Ah. May as well eat it. Oh my god. No. No. F- put your tongue on it for two seconds. Actually, like, it, it it's literally that got bad? me. It literally got me. It's not bad. Oh, just a fucking big old long hair on it. Oh, Brown's had it in his mouth. That's why. <sighs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, yeah, it does instantly give you a little bit of heat on the tongue. Yeah, but not enough. Might as well eat it, I reckon. Or at least bite into it and just see what happens. I'm so scared. I reckon eat it. This is always a bad time. Oh, you could just swallow like a tablet. <gasps> Wouldn't do anything if you did that. Stop. Oh, <laughs> Guys, come on. Let's not be silly. Matt, 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 off he goes, shoot, off he goes. Spit it out! Spit it out! No! Swallow no. it! No! I don't want it! Oh. It's okay. Oh my god, you're, you're crazy. Okay, either. Swallow it, 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 swallow it. Swallow it. Swallow it. Swallow it. Thing, Slippery little snake. No. Have you chewed it? Yeah, yeah I saw him chewing it. It's not that bad. Dude. This one's alright compared to the other one. <laughs> yeah, my tongue's stinging, eh? 
Uh, uh, let's continue with the prank. It's good that it's not. It's just nice and tiny. Just have a drink. I'm have, a drink. have a drink. Have a drink. Have a drink. Have a drink of some milk. Oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> have you forgotten? Oh. Just sculled it. Oh. 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 No, no, don't no. open it. Ah. For fuck's sake, Matt. Matt's just opened the mince bottle. For fuck's ah. sake. There you go. And we're back. <laughs> <laughs> I did a little fart. Yeah. I've done a little fart. And um, I'll tell you what, uh, it's prank call time. Yeah, I'm going to call a butcher that someone has sent in and said that this particular butcher is very aggressive. So I'm going to call as Arnold Fine and see if I can't sell him some pigs of mine. This is the butcher oh, 2.0. Oh. Mm. Okay, you shut up and you listen. Huh? I have a premium product. Uh, hello, uh, my name is Arnold Fine. I a small farm uh, north of Brisbane. And I uh, look to sell uh, my pork, uh, fresh pork. I uh, call butcher. Who I speak to where you are about to uh, you buy uh, my pork? Uh, mate, you're up to ring up in the morning. <laughs> What say? Say that again. I not uh, hear you. Uh, weird noise. I we'll have to ring up in the morning and talk to the boss. Uh, no, I need to speak someone now. Can you take a message for boss? What's the message? Message for boss. Okay, tell him. Okay, you have pen. You write this down. Okay, you say Arnold Fine. He probably know my name. Okay, I uh, quite famous for sell pork Brisbane. My name Arnold Fine. I have a fifty pick. Fresh, fresh, organic pick, okay? Hand reared by myself. They live in my house. Write that down. They live in my house with my wife, okay? So they treat it like human people, okay? Pig, human, same thing. I won't sell, okay, per pick, $500. That's it, $500 per pick. But I sell all 50 pig. You write that down, okay? This pig like my family, okay? Right? Make That's it, pretty cheap. Make, I know, I know. Okay, must, uh, I must sell pig. I am leaving the country, okay? I must go home, uh, so I must sell pig quickly. That's why I say I don't have till morning to uh, call back because um, uh, I have an uh, offer, okay, from other butcher. I need to uh, get, I need to flick, flick them away now. So uh, you tell your boss, a uh, huge deal, big deal. He a businessman, huh? so he want good business. And you tell him, my pick like my family. Huh? I love my pick, uh, fresh. Um, they, uh, sleep. Can I talk to him now? Yes, uh, put him on. Uh, he's not here. Did you just say put him on? No, Didn't you, 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 you lied to him. Don't waste my time, okay? I'm trying to do you favor, okay? You make uh, so much money from my pick. Fresh, premium pick. My wife, she's sick. My pick, premium, fresh pick. Do not lie and waste my time. You want a pig or no? You no. Sick. Snake, you you snake, you fucking snake, huh? You dare waste my time, you know, you don't want to pick because my accent, huh? Well, I, I know where you live, client. Yeah, pigs are too cheap. What do you mean? I need to get rid of my pig, okay? I, le I leave the country on Monday, huh? Are you clean? Are you clean or no, huh? Clean, huh? You climb around with me. I tell you, I need to get rid of pick. Otherwise, I get gun and uh, I have to shoot them and uh, leave them in the uh, flicking around in the backyard, huh? You see what I say, huh? You write that down. I see what you say. You slack. Climb. Huh? 50. 50 pick, okay? 500. Times a fifty, you understand? 
You're a businessman, eh? Well, let's talk, eh? We do business, eh? What say you, darling, huh? Maybe me, you sit down, uh, we work. Oh. <laughs> Dude, uh, that was great. Very funny. Yeah, I didn't get a, a reaction. Klein? You call him Klein? <laughs> Klein? Yeah. Oh, oh, my God. God. Not the best, uh, but um, we're gonna, I'd, I'd like the butcher idea. Let's do like fucking five of them next week and get a good reaction. Dude, I, I, butchers are just great people. That's not true. Sorry. Not all of them. Yeah, I'm sure there's a murder. You're really there. generalizing there, Michael. I but hate generalists. That was very so pro- I'm not progressive then. Get Matty's chair and let's fucking get out of here. Yeah. All right, Matt, this is your chair for next week. Are you ready for oh, it? I'm excited. You have to try it. Can I get a drum roll, please, everybody? Do I have to close my eyes? Yeah. Are you gonna move this or just No no. It's it's very very How long do I have to do this for? Close your eyes, Matt Brown. Oh no, boss, it's okay, it's all right. You just Fucking panic. Be here with us, please. It's okay, Bosley. It's okay. Why do I feel like this is just going to be a piss take and I'm, and it's just, it's, you've, oh, Matt, come Michael on. hasn't taken a lot, you know, of interest in, you know, the segments lately. You've bit slack. I feel like this is just going to be one, just a no, one no, hit we've joke. We've thought about this one. Okay. And this will be yours for the next five. Close your eyes, drum Matt. Drum kit, drum, drum roll. All right, here it comes. He's bringing it in. Close your fucking eyes, Matt Brown. Close your okay. fucking eyes. Be careful. 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 Watch the cords. Okay. Watch the lights. Do I need to move my feet? All right. Ready and open your eyes. Go. It's a <laughs> bike. Yeah. It's a bike. It's not so bad, hey? You guys didn't take any effort. This at all. <laughs> Dude, what do you mean? You guys didn't this is good effort. shit. Can you try it out? This is going to be used. I've tried this already. <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna be. That's, look how fucking good that is. Speaking yeah. to the mic. Prop this up. Sorry. Can you prop this so it doesn't fall? Yeah, easy. Yeah. Just you put use a- that leg on that side and that leg on that side, and then can it doesn't you please fall. Please test over. it. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah. If you can do have you please, that. If test you can prop out. it up, I've already sat on it. Trust me, I have. Yeah, yeah just show, show everyone, everyone show what it looks like. How beautiful. And then <laughs> show everyone what it looks like when you're on the bike. We'll we'll cheer out with the we're the best because there's no one there's nothing better than brown on a bike. Let's get it caught. Yeah, that's pretty good. No, put just your, put, put your, your other leg, leg down. down. Yeah, put your, down. put your other leg down. Yeah, it's propped. There you go. There you go. And you can rock back to back to back. You yeah, can, that's all right. You can put that your, actually looks good. Right. Yeah, you can put your laptop on the handlebars. Fuck me, that's look. You look so hot right now, Brown. This is gonna help you in the Tinder segment thing too. I've been learning. You're a bad you boy, like Brown, on the bike. Athletic and mm, it's nice. on a bicycle. Helpful. Michael had a bicycle, but now that bicycle's Brown's. Anyway, guys, don't Spot forget on. to like, comment, subscribe, give us a five star review. Thank you for listening. We love you, cunts. We'll see We're you guys next week. Follow We're my new Instagram. Best. Sorry, oh, James. Sorry, it's James Follow Lee. James Lee. Instagram. Sorry, <coughs> I shouldn't have done James that. Was, Lee. It's James Lee it. underscore. We've done it in earlier in the podcast, though. Remember? So, oh, We're yeah. the best. Yeah. We're the best. Yeah. We're the best. We're the best. 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 Good best. boy.